Hey guys, it's Madame Wario. Welcome to my Saturday night stream where we're gonna be playing. <laughs> Do you have to? We're gonna be playing some Animal Crossing. Yes, we are. We are. Kitty's here. Kitty's ready. She's like, oh, well, better make it about me then. So, um, anyway, happy Saturday. I feel like I haven't played this game in about a thousand in 20 years because um, Tuesday's stream it was Blackout Tuesday so I participated in that to um, show support for Black Lives Matter. I don't like to get political on my channel or on my platforms that's just not the kind of person I am not the kind of content I produce but I think it is important to um, to let everybody know bleh, to trip over my words to let everybody know that I um, you know, I want to show as much support as possible in this uh, time that is long overdue for change in our world. So, anyway, uh, that's why we haven't seen this in a while. So, um, that's Kitty. She's, <laughs> she's kind of, she has a lot of white on her belly, so the light makes her, like, all blurred out. But, oh my gosh, somebody... Um, is giving that good kitty a treat right away, Phantom Tempest. Uh, <laughs> thank you for that. Anyway, welcome to the stream, you guys. Welcome to Saturday Night, where we play Animal Crossing New Horizons. Um, I've been trying to do things a little differently every single week to keep things fresh and fun and fabulous. Um, but yeah. Uh, please, while you're here tonight, at some point, if you type in exclamation alert... I need everybody to vote for their favorite uh, St. Jude donation from the campaign uh, of last month, from St. Jude Play Live last month, because whatever gets the top vote is going to stick around for the rest of the year um, and, you know, from now on. So I want to get as many votes as possible. That's going to close um, out and be announced tomorrow, so uh, definitely submit your vote that's what i ask so thank you to everybody who's voted so far let me go ahead and say hi to some people and then we'll give kitty a, a treat so i'm gonna say hi to everybody who's here so phantom tempest yo yo yoshi 95 daniel haruhana angelia haywood caleb funhouse 64 uh casanova 64 alexa zero master starman scottman 895 Mr. Wario, Water Pixels, Shy Guy for Days, and Odin Speck. Welcome. Also, Stardev94 and Panda Plays64. Welcome to the stream. Uh, really quickly, also, I want to um, credit my patrons on Patreon. Thank you for your extra support each and every month to being awesome and fabulous people. I know we're getting a lot of audio overlap, sorry about that. Uh, but thank you so much. I made it rainbow for Pride Month, so enjoy the rainbow. Thank you guys so much for all of your support to Patreon. And if you're interested, um, go ahead and uh, type exclamation Patreon in the chat and you can get more information about how to join the Patreon family or below in the video description if you're watching this on YouTube later. Um, Okay, I'm gonna give Kitty a treat really quick. Yeah, somebody's gonna get a treat. You, yeah, you excited? There's a, oh, oh, there's a treat for my good girl. Kitty's like, oh my gosh. Thank you, Phantom Tempest, for the treat redeem. I know we had one yesterday too that Kitty wouldn't come out for, so I gave it to her after the stream, but, um. Got a shout out to Rockstar. Thanks, Stardev. Um, Master Starman, I did not. I didn't really get on Discord after my stream last night. I was like doing other stuff. So I completely forgot. But I'll I'll have to check it after tonight's stream. Pineapple for fun, Jigmad3373, and Armand2017 joining us. Uh, welcome, you guys. Oh, thank you, Pineapple. I decided to curl my hair today. I try to do my hair differently for every stream because I try to do my hair differently every day. Um, and I was like, I haven't curled my hair in, like, months. Like, I need to actually, like, do something fun. So, a lot of it's fallen out. Like, it's fallen down. But it has, like, a gentle wave now, so it's good. Um, Marianne2573, welcome. Oh, 
your sister had her baby today. That's amazing. Congratulations. That's awesome. I'm a fourth aunt. Well, congratulations, Marianne. That's exciting. A June 6th baby. Um, I, none of my sisters have kids yet, so I am, it's weird being almost 30 years old and like none of your sisters who are all older than you have kids. I don't know. We just, nobody does. So, uh, there's nothing wrong with that though. It's just like, it's kind of ironic that I would have all sisters and no children at this point. Um, I am getting married next year. That's the plan. I'm supposed to get married at the very beginning of next year. I have no idea what's happening with that now, thanks to, um, you know, the virus that took over the world and caused everything to shut down. But, you know, it's got to be one of those things that's like, oh, uh, we'll just have to play it by ear and see what happens. And eventually it'll happen. So, um, but yeah. So anyway... <laughs> Unless you marry someone with siblings, which could be likely. You don't know if you'll be an uncle. Well, if you're an only child, then yeah. But when you have three older sisters, it's kind of like, oh. Um, so. I'm too young to raise a kid, yet I have one. Oh, yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> I'm like, huh? You're too young, but you have one. I don't understand. I mean, I guess I understand that concept. I actually watched a pretty funny video during quarantine um and it was it's actually a youtube channel that kind of like took off because of this video it was this um mother and daughter duo and the mom is only she was only 14 when she had her daughter and she was telling the story of having her daughter to her daughter like because she was the same age as her mom was when she had her um and it's kind of funny like just hearing her talk about like the things she was doing and the things she had. She's like, oh yeah, I had this American girl clock. It was hot. And it's like, oh my God, <laughs> so young. Don't have kids, at, don't have kids as a teenager, but it happens, you know, that's basically, that was her point basically. But um, they're like a really funny duo. So um, my, I do have a child and a grumpy old man. Kitty's my child, and Queen is my grumpy old man, and I take care of them both, so it's true. Yeah, $15 so far for that big RAM upgrade. That's my current donation goal. I know there's a lot more important things to be donating to in the world right now, guys, and I, I totally encourage that over upgrading my RAM. Um, but that it's just one of those things. I have it out in the open, so if people do donate or feel the need to, or the desire i shouldn't say the need because that sounds like negative i'm very very grateful for all donations i receive um they're never expected always appreciated but you know if you are enjoying my content and you feel like um throwing some money my way i am forever grateful for that i just want you guys to always know where it's going so like that's what that is but yeah um I want my grandchildren to call me queen when I'm a grumpy oldie. Oh my god, that would be amazing. So, uh, we're probably going to be pretty chill tonight. I'm going to do kind of what I did last time. I have not played this game at all today. I've reserved it for this stream. So, first things first, I'm going to be doing a lot of dailies. Um, a lot of shopping. And uh, just getting that out of the way. And then... I asked my friend Dark Minded Sith if I could visit his town because he's really cool about decorating his towns. Like, he always uh, sets things up really awesome, but he has to work, so I don't know that he'll be back in time to get to do that. Um, so we'll see, but I want to do maybe some design, maybe some fun stuff tonight. Uh, do you know... Do you know why you want a green screen? It seems like you have good features. Um. Really, my green screen is more for my setup that I have for all the HD stuff. So, like, whereas we haven't seen a, a ton of that on my channel previous channel, what am I saying? Channel previously because I didn't have an HD capture device. Now I do, so now I can kind of upgrade things. Um, because if you look at my setup, this is my setup for HD. I have myself kind of boxed in, which is fine. I guess I should remove the. St. Jude supporter. I feel so dirty removing it, but, um, you know, I guess it is over. <laughs> it's so sad. Um, it feels like, oh, I don't want it to be 
over. It was so much fun. But see how, like, I'm boxed in? That'll make it where it's just me over in the corner. You don't have to see all the chaos. So, I mean, it's, it's just one of those things. It kind of makes it a little bit um, more professional looking, which is kind of my goal at the moment. So, um... But yeah, and I, I already have the funds for that. It's just a matter of time just waiting for it to come back in stock. It's not in stock. The one that I want is like one that goes on my chair and isn't ginormous because I don't have a ginormous space. So I'm like, no. Um, but it's not in stock yet. It sold out. People kind of went crazy during quarantine buying things online and kind of doing the same thing. Like, oh, now that I'm home, I'll upgrade all my stuff. And so it's like a lot of things are unavailable right now. And that's one of them. So, oh my god, is this Toy Day music my heart? It is. This is actually my own playlist. This is my top 10 Animal Crossing songs playlist that I made before um, Animal Crossing New Horizons came out. So this is like my top 10 favorite songs leading up to this game. Um, but yeah. So... What? Butt video 2, now with green- yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make Madame Wario's butt revealed with a green screen. It'll be really amazing. Um, but yeah, so, it's pretty hot, pretty great. Mega Waluigi, welcome. I, did anybody else walk in, by the way, while I was talking? I don't think anybody did. Uh, oh, Scott Man, thank you for the bits, girl. Thank you so much for the- <laughs> The butt revealed bits. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Um, okay, so I think we're about ready to get started. Uh, so why don't we go ahead and do that? So, I'm gonna switch screens. Unfortunately, I've got to turn the Toy Day music off. I apologize. I know. I know. Oh, Big Pixie! Just making his mark, like... Hey ladies. Okay, I'm, thank you so much, Pixie, and welcome to the stream. Thank you for changing the game for me, girl. He always knows. Uh, fingers crossed that this sounds okay. Last time it was like a pain in the butt. It kept doing weird, weird things. So I'm hoping it doesn't do that last time. I had like a three-part stream last Saturday because of technical weirdness. So, Marching band, I'm doing well. Welcome to the stream. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and just keep going, see if things are okay. Um, so we now have an art gallery in the museum. I started donating things to the museum, you guys, because before I wasn't, I was really focused on getting funds to make things in my town, like bridges and ramps and upgrade my house. I just upgraded my house. I have a brand new kitchen. I wasn't gonna do that, but then I got so many cute things for it that I, I had to do it. I was like, I kinda want like a cozy cottage house. So that's what I ended up doing. I probably will do a little shark hunting tonight. I probably will. It's a little hard to do. Oh no, it's not. There's no lag anymore. Oh my God, there was lag before and I couldn't, I couldn't fish. That's why I like never fished before. Cause there was so much lag that I like I use audio to like catch fish because if I look at it, I'll panic and I'll be like, <gasps> and it's, I'll lose everything. So I, um, yeah, I have no lag anymore because of the new capture card. So yay, we can do that. Um, so yeah, shark season, it's totally hot. Check in, welcome to the stream. But anyway, I finally started donating things. So then that triggered Red to come to my town. Um, and get our first painting and then the museum upgraded yesterday like it was Well, it upgraded really today, but it was in the process of like building Yesterday so and flick came to my town During the week like two days ago, so I was able to get another um, I was able to get another butterfly for our garden. So that was super fun. So um, where, was I playing this game? Oh, I play this game throughout the week just to keep up with things. I honestly play this file more than my other file. Like, my other file is so fun, but I like this town better. Like, I, I didn't anticipate this, but that's what happens. Okay. Ter I'm terrible. Our mom is so weird in this game. Alright, what you send? What you send me? 
freaking dowel slippers. I'm giving those away. Oh, God, I can't. These freaking mom's handmade aprons. I keep giving them away to people. All the mom's handmade stuff, with the exception of the backpack, I'm like, no, get out. Um, before we do anything, we're gonna go to the Able Sisters. Sup, Tank? I got Tank's photo, I got Cherry's photo, I am ready. Um, so. But yeah. Anyway, yeah, fr friendship is how you feel, it's a style. Her mom's super itchy, weird, so dumb. Check out Murphy. Okay, I got Hamfrey, the hamster, camping in my town this week, and so I tried to get him to move in. I was like, I'm gonna have him move in. Tank can move out. Cherry can move out. I'm kind of like, the OGs can move out because they're not my favorites. Like, they're okay, but they're not my fave base. Plus, I got their pictures already, so I'm like, I don't care. Um, but he kept wanting to kick Murphy out. I'm like, Hamfrey, you can't kick Murphy out. I'm sorry, but every time he's like, oh, how about I go ask... Murphy. I'm like, how about you don't do that and you just don't move in here. And it was after I played like 400 card games. Like, I had to work. I had to work. I tried to take Hamfrey, but he wanted to replace Murphy and that wasn't allowed. Uh, so I'm like, mm, fine, get out of here. Thank God it wasn't freaking, um, not dizzy. What's the name of the rhino that keeps appearing every five seconds on the Mystery Islands? So freaking annoying. Um, Hornsby. I was like, he has a similar name. Yeah, Hornsby. Thank God it wasn't him or I'd be so freaking annoyed. So Sable's been giving us custom patterns every day. I meant to save some stuff to like customize with said, with said things, but or said patterns, not my style. Well, stop looking at it and let me give you something. Okay, thank you. <laughs> I like that we just pushed him out of his own thought. Um, oh, that's too cute for you. Here, you get to wear mom's handmade apron because I don't care and I'm trying to get rid of this crap. Do it. Yeah. So hot. Alright, you look great, Murph. Thanks for not giving us a gift in return. But, that's cool. Um, so. Uh, anyway, I added some chairs over here in front of the gay club slash runway. So now we can probably sometime soon start having cosplay contests, uh, fashion shows, all that stuff. I kind of want to have like a lot more of my town established before that. I shouldn't say a lot more. There's really not a ton more to do. Um, but yeah. And then over here, here we have the butterfly garden. I added the great purple emperor or whatever it's called. Um, I, I need to donate some stuff to the museum today too because I've been trying to, like I said, work on that so it's not so bear and we're not we're failing to unlock things you know so um thank you for the host um okay so if red appears he'll appear back on our secret beach which is right here and he's actually here tonight i don't think that i have my no i don't i was like i don't think that i have my ladder on me so we can't go back there yet um and most of the time I have to look up the paintings just to see, like, if they're real or not. Um, because sometimes they're, like, so freaking subtle that you can't tell. So, um, here, take these slippers. I do not want them. Anyway, I'm not sure if they're your style. Maybe because you don't wear shoes. Oh, sweet. Concierge uniform. I really wanted to give this straw hat to Frigia, and I couldn't find her the other day, and now I'm still hanging on to this straw hat, and it's really, really annoying. Boo1220, welcome to the stream. Um. <laughs> so. Oh, Big Pix is online. Although, my villagers tend to hang out in each other's houses a lot. Like, they just do. Um. But yeah. All right. 
right. Biscuits, making some cool stuff. A golden what? A golden dung beetle? Okay, give it to me. More golden recipes. I also did a thing where I decided to um, make... I decided to make every recipe I possibly could, like, with all the materials I had. Um, and so I kind of went crazy, and I made bank doing that, you guys. Like, you make so much money doing that. If you have, like, an obsessive amount of materials, like, way too many, then I highly recommend you do that. Just because it, you know, there's, like, a little check mark next to everything we've made. Oh my god, that's so ridiculous. Um... And it was a good way to just, like, use up extra materials that I really didn't need. Like, I didn't need to have, you know, 14 stacks of 30 hardwood. I was like, I need to get this crap out of here. And you make more money selling actual made goods than just materials alone. Which I, like, I, I don't really sell materials alone anyway, but, like, it's just a good idea. Just to get rid of the clutter. It's all about decluttering. If there are any sharks here, which there are not. Shark shadows are the best because if they are sideways, you can see the fin sticking out. So it's pretty fantastic. It's always a large shadow. It always has a fin sticking out. It's a lot harder to tell um, from the front because you can't see the fin until they like circle around. Yes, I also caught a great white shark this week. So hyped. Why did I just turn this light off? I didn't mean to do that. Look, I'm not trying to touch your lights. Um, I did. Sure did. All right, kind of weird but amazing. Cool. Thanks, Julian. You're so weird. I need to start talking to my neighbors more on screen. Like, I have not been talking to them as much on stream as I want to because they will ask you to do things for them, and I haven't really shown that off at all. So I'm like, we probably should get to that. Look at this Michael Jackson coat. How cute. Um, simple parka. All right, cool. I'm just going to kind of casually give things away as we walk by people. Um, and I need to get... Julian's house is a lot... It was really cute before, and I've been slowly ruining it by giving him really weird things to put in it. So, I know. Kind of sucks. Oh wait, what was that? No. Probably a freaking sea bass. I try to kind of scare the fish, like, that are not sharks at this time, so that sharks will potentially spawn. Um, but yeah. Okay, message in a bottle. Oh, from Pecan. Oh shoot, Pecan giving us a freaking recipe we already know. Did I get a tank anything yet? Look at how cute he is wearing his sungla sunglasses. Uh, here, you can wear the simple parka. Yes, you gave Kurt the shark! I was playing with Odie the other night and we were shark hunting. And yeah, he was trying to give Kurt a shark to go in his terrible house. If you guys were here the time I visited Odie, which would have been... I think that was last week. That feels like it was forever ago, but that was last weekend. Um, Kurt has, like, the worst house I've ever seen. Like, it is a dump. Um, oh, that's cute. But not cute enough to keep, sorry. Um, so we're going to... There's Red just hanging out. What's up, boy? Gotta pull up Red's bio! Um, where is Red's bio? The last bio we looked at was Fang. How appropriate. Alright, Red. Red. Okay, so Red's facts. Crazy, rips people off, part of the black market, part of the mafia, part of the underground railroad, part of the KKK. Okay, maybe not. <laughs> okay. Wow! Awesome! That's a uh, dark... That's a dark, some dark lore right there. That must have been a fast bio. Let's just put it that way. He's not crazy, he's jolly! <laughs> he's jolly. What if his name was Jolly Red? Like, can you imagine? Can you imagine? Alright, I'm in. 
Let's go. I'm, I'm ready. Yeah, what an edgy bio. What the heck? Okay, we needed a screen to disappear that- I don't know. <gasps> Look at how cute she is in her strawberry pajamas we gave her the other day! Oh my god, she is the cutest. She is the cutest. And we're gonna ruin it by giving her this blossom tee. But this blossom tee is also really cute. I know she has a cute hair clip in! I love that she wears these little bows. Oh, it looks cute on her too though. But she didn't like it enough to give us a gift. Dang it. Alright, whatever. Um. So. Cool. His his nickname in pre- I don't know but about you guys, but his nickname in previous games, definitely Crazy Red. Also, this table's pretty cool. This matches our Imperial stuff that we have that we're kind of reserving for our Mean Girls room, so we'll go ahead and buy that. Uh, blah, blah. And this is cute too! How much? Alright, we'll go ahead and buy that, because that will actually go really well in the room I just made. Uh, check out this wrestling figure. We now have summer items, by the way. I haven't shown this off yet, because we haven't actually played in June yet, so... Um, now in this corner, there will be a different summer exclusive item every day. And so far I've gotten like all fans. I'm like, cool. But a lot of the time there are surfboards as well. I don't know what else you can get. I've only seen fans and surfboards. Um, oh my god, I love the antique furniture. It's so adorbs. Um, and red delicate blooms wall. Common wall. I like the red delicate blooms wall, but you know what? We'll get it because it might actually go well. I was gonna make the Mean Girls room all pink, but it really needs to be red. Like, so I actually should have looked at the flooring too. I didn't really look at it. Um, arched brick flooring. We need like a red carpet. Uh, oh, cool paint flooring. Um. Yeah, I don't know. We need like a red carpet or something. I think we're gonna make it mostly red with pink accents because we already have a pink girly room. Like we already have the cookie room, which is the pink cute stuff or the white cute stuff. Um, and I don't really think we need to have two rooms like that. That's just kind of stupid. So if we're actually going to make a mean girls room, I think it needs to be a little bit more intense, so that's kind of what I'm thinking. Okay. Let's go ahead and go to, uh, oh my god, Tutu is so cute. We're gonna go in our house and get, or I'm gonna show off this room because I need to. Likes antique furniture but won't buy any of that used stuff. True. True. I am so, like, not. I- it, I take after my mom in that way. I like, I can't do secondhand. Like, it doesn't happen. I cannot, I can't go to Goodwill. I can't go to, like, I just can't do it. It, it smells used and I can't do it. Um, everybody's like, oh, it's so cheap. And I'm like, yeah, if you don't know how to shop for bargains, girl. Uh, thank you so much for the host. But yeah. So anyway. I do need a burn book for the Mean Girls room. I'm definitely planning that. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna put all these things in storage because it's just easier that way. Uh, we still need to give that to Frigia. Do, 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 do. I need to get out my ladder. And I hate having all this crap in my pocket all the time. Like, this is why yeah, this is why I don't carry around my ladder and stuff, and why I wish the tool ring was an outside thing. Uh, we've got to move these to our pocket because, like I said, things were closed yesterday, couldn't donate. Uh, I think we have bugs and stuff to donate to. A lot of these butterflies are- all these butterflies that are in, like, threes or singles are reserved for, um, for Flick. But pretty much everything else. I do want an Orchid Mantis just for my house, too. But, like, everything else needs to go to- 
who's fa dang I was like who's fancy cage all this stuff needs to go to the museum no cool okay so can't wait for you to get pinky maybe yeah I don't know that we will but uh, this is our new room this is our kitchen so I decided to make a cold, uh, cold, cozy, old-timey kitchen, and I kind of like the mint chocolate chip idea. Um, so everything in here is, like, mint accents with, like, ch chocolate colors, so, like, white chocolate. I try to do, like, all the colors of chocolate. So, like, white chocolate, milk chocolate, dark chocolate. And, uh, this table is actually going to be, like, uh, really perfect for where this, uh, blah, blah, whatever it's called microwave and toaster are because I had to make that iron low table because it would not I didn't have anything else that was like that size so this is actually going to be a lot this is perfect because this is going to be a lot better I think I don't know we'll try it and see uh, yeah yay see it looks a little bit better like that I think and then we have like, you know, should it be like on that side? Yeah, I kind of like it like that. Um, but yeah, I ended up with all this mint accent, uh, th these mint colored accents. So, and I think Cookie sent me this teapot and I thought that was really cute too. So I was like, yo, we got to get this going here. So this is currently our room. Um, and then I also, I tried some of the, like, I tried some of the uh, ice cream lamps in here. Like, I was going to see how it would look, but I didn't really like it. I thought it looked too cramped. Like, I was like, uh, mm. like, I don't know. I just couldn't get behind it. I tried this one. I tried the mint colored one, and I ended up liking just the, the stuff like we have in here. And, like, the iron low table didn't look bad, but I, I think I like this better. Also, should we put this like that? No, it's too too heavy on the... No, no. Too heavy on the one side. So, yeah. But anyway, that is what I decided to do with this next room that we got. So, yay! All this chocolate talk's got me begging for chocolate! Oh, thank you guys. I'm glad you like it kitchen on the right classic my kitchen in my original room it was the second room I ever got because it was the one that I got a bunch of stuff for right away so I had a um I have my kitchen on, in the back on my other room but yeah see I have Cherry's photo and I have Tank's photo so I really really love how this room is turning out though so that's perfect that we found that piece of furniture uh, thanks marching band, but I'm probably not going to be uh, doing anything like that. That kind of opens a can of worms when it's like, hey, I have gifts for you. Hey, I have this. And then I end up like going to one person's island and not other people's. So I like to keep that random, but I appreciate the offer. So anyway, um, we have imperial chest, imperial bed, and then the cute bed. I don't know which one of these I'll like better. But both match the Imperial stuff, so I'm kind of like, well, and then I figure the Antique Vanity and the Velvet Stool will go up there. I don't know if we'll end up keeping this pink mini fridge or if it'll be too tacky up there, uh, but we're basically just hanging on to it for the time being. If I get a better, if I feel like I want to add more to the table in my other room, in my kitchen, I'm going to add this mug because it matches. Um, but yeah, I, I'm trying to be very minimal on the stuff that I'm storing because I don't want to have a ton of it. So, and one of these two walls would be good upstairs. Kind of, again, just depends on the look I really want. Um, actually, the rose flooring would probably go really well with the red delicate blooms wall. So maybe we'll do that uh, for upstairs. That'll be our next upgrade. So that's kind of why I'm like thinking ahead and trying to gather things. It's also a larger room, so I'm kind of like, uh, you know. Um, oh, thanks, Pineapple. I appreciate that. But yeah. So now I think I have everything. Yeah, I have everything for the museum anyway. Um, 
I have not water pixels. I just found out what that was like a few weeks ago. I've never used it because I've never needed something bad enough to use it. Now, what in the world is this, girl? Oh, from Rags? Odin's P1 Nut. Love Odie. Wow, thanks, Odie. Thanks for that, um, that hot letter. And also, oh, a nutcracker. How cute. Yay. What does this look like? Oh, it's literally a- that's so amazing! I love it. Okay, well we'll go pick that up later. I don't want to accidentally give that away. Um, I love it. Still don't play the stock market? I- I played it once and that was enough, Master Starman. I made like 10 million bells, so like I never needed to do it again. I was like, uh... Whatever, guess I'm done with that, because, like, I don't really need more money than that, you know? It's like, I still have, like, five million bells. Like, I paid off my house, I paid off Odie's house, I was, like, giving money to other- Like, I didn't- I don't need to worry about it, so I lucked out. Um, but yeah. So I was like, okay. Alright, take these dang fossils. Girl. Um, yeah, like, if you have, like, um, 10 million bells and your house is finished and you don't want to do, like, a total redesign to your town, like, you just end up with more money than you need. And so I need to, um, I need to give some of that money to this file from my other game, because it's on my other game. Um, okay, I have all this stuff. Oh, yay, all four. We're building up. We are building up. Okay, so we should go look at my painting, too. No. I like donating multiple things at once because then Blathers doesn't go on for like 400 years. So, is a rainbow stag rare? I don't think it's the rarest, but I don't- I don't think it's like super common. Um, I think it's kind of somewhere in the middle. Okay, so this is our painting that we got, and it is, mm. oh, oh, it's like, kind of like the Lady of Shalot, but not really, um, sinking painting, I, I don't know, Ophelia, there we go, Ophelia, I was like, I'm on the right track, but it's not, um, it's not, it's definite. It's not Sh Lady of Shalot, but it's similar, same time period. Um. So shout out to Ophelia. Ha. Okay, so now we need to go see Red for real. In his element, he'll be on his boat. And we are going to do KK tonight. We will. I just didn't- uh, the only reason I didn't do that first was because I wanted to go to the Able Sisters and then I immediately got, like, way sidetracked. So we'll do that after we see Red. We'll do that after Red. I- oh! I didn't even show this off either! So, I'm in the process of building a ramp up here, but I now have a pool area. I totally kind of copied off a of Pixie because he did this, like, batch- bat- batch- back beach area. And so I did the same thing. I set up like a little back beach with a hot tub and um, a little like drink stand. You know, just a fun little place to hang out. Picnic. And then obviously the pool area off to the side. So it's super cute. So thanks Pixie for the idea. I wanted to do a pool area and at first I was going to put it like over here somewhere. Um, but I think that what I'm going to end up doing is using this space where the pool is going to go for a giant garden. And because this is all very flowery and floral over here anyway, and so I felt like the pool area would not fit very well. So I was like, well, maybe we won't do that. Um, and I'm gonna give you this hat because you need it. Oh my god. Oh, she looks so cute in it! She looks so cute in this hat. I love it. 
Okay. They're always so worried about the Happy Home Academy, and I'm like, I never give a crap, and they always give me good rank, so... Girl! Okay, so let's go ahead and get our ladder out. Go downtown, go to see Red. Um... Yeah, look at how tiny this boat is. Like, it's so tiny. And then look at the inside. There's no way that this is this same boat. Even if you go down, like, mm -mm, no way. Okay, freaking fake Jolly Red. Oh, what? Oh, big Zenonia hype. Whoa. <laughs> Zenonia, Zenonia, thank you so much for the sub hype. Oh, whoa. Thank you so much for the subscription. Welcome to the stream and welcome back to the Ba family. Uh, thanks so much. Oh. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we're in reds. So we're gonna pick our poison for the day. Um, and only one of his pieces will be real. Well, you can only get one piece a day anyway, so... Back in the other- the old games, only one piece could be real. I don't know if it's the same in this game, but, like, you can only get one piece a day, so... Inform informative statue? No. Um... You think both statues are real? They're both kind of scary! <laughs> um... The informative statue's definitely real. Well, maybe we'll, we'll get the boring AF informative statue then. Um, DoryGuy64, welcome. But yeah. Uh, I love this painting. This is like one of my favorite paintings in real life. Alright, let's get the freaking informative statue. Um, we're gonna take a closer look, for sure. I love that it has this, because I was like, it is dark and dingy in here, like, what's the fake version look like? I would have to look it up. I'm just gonna leave it to big pics. Um, this is like, probably one of the most boring things we could get, but we have to get it. The fake is blue. Okay, cool. Good to know. Alright, well we'll go ahead and get this crap to get it out of the way. And sold. Where does Red get this stuff? He just goes into the Louvre for some of this stuff and is like, mm, I'm gonna casually take the Mona Lisa. So yeah. That's so weird. Both statues are real. Uh, oh. Okay. Sweet. Yeah. Patrons of the arts. Shady seller. Hot. So now if we try to, um get both he'll he'll tell us like oh you can only get one um so yeah i guess the slab is less creepy than that guy so let's get that all right bye red it was fun shopping with you today but <laughs> oh that can you do that i didn't realize you could have like people come to your town and do that well, shoot, Odie, I might need your assistance. I think Odie might be getting dinner right now, so I'll have to bug him when he- <gasps> Oh my god, there's a scorpion right there. It scared me. Oh my god, I'm so bad at this. Ah! <laughs> that was so bad at it. I basically just screamed. <laughs> I swung the net without even looking at it. I should have at least faced the direction it was in. Um, okay, well that's about as good as I am at catching freaking crap. So, yeah, right. <laughs> Guys, I have a new emote too. It's the, the miss emote. So you can definitely uh, use miss for that because it was a big miss. I'm sorry. Uh, that was embarrassing. Let me, no, that is not what I want to do. Uh, well, I might have Odie come here and buy that warrior. Oh, sweet. Rachel's online. Who? I don't... <sighs> Freaking waiting on approval. Oh, shoot. She sent me a request. I was like, <sighs> I sent her a request and she didn't respond? Oh, never mind. Um, quit being best friends. Am I best friends with everybody on here? 
Uh, uh, yeah. I'll ask Ben for later. Uh, sure. Okay. Um, yay! You finally got a fly from your rotten turnip! Woohoo! Um,. Should I buy Drago a hot tub? Yes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say yes to that. I'm gonna open my gate for best friends so Odie can come here, or Pixie, or whoever, I don't care. Um, to get that art, because it is a little bit difficult to get artwork, so. And then I can, uh, you know, they can join me for a song, but. Um... If you're asking to be friends, I don't know if I can say yes. I know, right? You want to be friends? I haven't seen any of those comments on YouTube lately. I don't like how Orville just stares into your soul. Yay, you got the whale shark! Sweet. Um, Four sharks today. Getting that grind on. Sharks are worth a lot, so if you guys um, shark hunt and then save them for CJ, you will make bank. Plus you'll get some pretty cool statues if you want to get like shark statues. It's a good reason to um, save them. I'm going to just gather some shells. Uh, there are now summer shells, by the way. Um, they, they're blue, they look like conch shells, but like, or conch shells, I just said that weird. I don't think there are any other colors besides blue, but there are definitely, like, recipes for them. Um, Odie got a recipe, like, right away that was starry, sans, flooring, and then I got the same recipe, like, yesterday, so I was like, ooh, oh, there's my nutcracker. Um, but yeah. Do I still get comments on my Mario Kart video? Oh, I sure do. I sure do. My favorite is, but I unlocked me outfit B from doing XYZ, and I'm like, this video is 10 years old, people. It's 10 years ago. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> people are just, you know, they don't look at the date something was uploaded. They just assume it was uploaded, like, today, because they first saw it today. So... Um, yeah, the ones beside the statue were definitely fake AF. Uh, well. <laughs> yeah, hey, wanna be friends? What a weird way to, like, hack. You know what I mean? Like, that is just, like, the weirdest way. Um, to hack the system. But, yeah. Like I said, if anybody has to ask to be your friend, probably not a good idea to be friends with them, because that's just weird. It's not how you make friends in real life. Um, and if somebody asked me that, I'd be like, no. <laughs> no, because you're a weirdo. So anyway. Um, yay, lightning bugs are here. I'm so happy lightning bugs are in town finally. So. Wait, there's another way to get me outfit B. Oh my gosh, me outfit B ruins my life. I just ran by a shark. That's all right. We'll we'll we're not shark hunting yet. We'll get sharks later. I'm kind of waiting on Odie. I also have no idea if Odie knows that he's supposed to be coming over. Um, Mega Waluigi, no, that's pro- if you came up to me and were like, hey, you wanna be friends? I'd be like, no, that's what I'm saying. Like, I, I would not- that's- that's not the way you make friends. I'm sorry. You can't command somebody to be your friend like that. <laughs> um, anyway. I need you to buy that statue, Odie. You gotta come over. You said you were on this game. I think I once asked someone to be my friend in sixth grade. I guess you could say it worked out. What? <laughs> oh, Mr. Oreo. It wouldn't have worked for me. It wouldn't have worked. Um, 
Yeah, you just need like 5,000 bells. So, got another great white shark. Woo! Yeah, if I I thought Odie was coming over, I'm like, uh, no, I'm not gonna. Also, I need to get my fossils for today. If I shark hunt now, he's gonna interrupt it unintentionally because of stream lag. So, um, I also need to hit all my rocks. I really do need to do this because, like I said, I used up like all my materials, and now if I want uh, iron or stone, especially iron. I need to make sure I'm doing this every day for a while. So. And I don't have things to give, uh... Shoot, I need more things to give people. I guess I need to get some of the stuff out of my house storage that I know I'm not gonna use. I need to show off Harv's Island at some point, uh, for the wedding stuff. That's like the new thing for the month of June. Which, by the way, that wedding stuff hates me because I was like, hey, um, I'm gonna, you know, you have to go and take their freaking wedding photos of these two characters I don't like. And when you do, they give you points based on how good of a job you do, and they must think I suck, like, horribly. Because first day I got six, the second day I got five of the little crystals you trade in for stuff. I'm like... And then I asked Odie, he's like, oh, I got 12, and then I got 11. I'm like, what? Are you serious? They hate me. So, um, yeah, that was really, really freaking weird. So I was like, fine, you guys hate me. I see how it is. But the wedding stuff is super cute. I wish it came in more colors, because uh, I don't think you can customize it. I think you only get, like, the one and done color. But, um... She's silver, how's it going? But yeah. So the wedding stuff's really cute, but like, I just wish there were color variations, for sure. Um. Oh, sweet, money rock. Oh, you can customize the wedding furniture? Oh, sweet, I thought you couldn't, because I swear I had it in my pocket when I was like, customizing stuff the other day, and it didn't give me the option. But shoot. Um, anyway. I'm just doing this. Odie, let me know when you're coming, because I don't want to be, like, hitting one of these rocks, and then here you, here you are. Um, yeah. Oh, shoot, I'm only gonna get seven now, crap. Yeah, I don't know where I'm gonna put a wedding area yet. Oh, never mind, that worked out. I'm probably not in my house. I guess I could have like a wedding basement maybe, cause I don't, but I think I still wanna do like the dungeon basement. I don't know if I'll actually do that though. I don't know, I kinda want my house to be like all cute and cozy. I don't know that I necessarily want part of it to be morbid. Um, you have time, okay. I mean, sweet. Um, so yeah, I might do like an area in my house. I have no idea what I'm doing though. Of course, I can't do that until I get like the final upgrade if I were going to do that, so I don't know how likely that is anyway. Yeah, love all customization for the wedding stuff for sure, girl. I gotta check it out now. I really don't have that many pieces though. Like I have two benches, uh, I think I have a table and I, a, like wall swag or whatever. Um, but that's pretty much it, so. And now Abel Sisters is closed for the night. So, no. Alright, well if Odie's gonna be a minute, then... Guys, where the heck are the fossils? I have not gotten any of the fossils for today, and I've seen, like, one. I guess I need to run around and fossil hunt. That would probably be a safer bet. I do not need any cherry trees, but feel free to bring cherries over and sell them, because my fruit in this town is peaches, so... Um... Okay... going to look for... Um, 
I need three more fossils. Teddy bear picnic area is so cute. I love it. And haunted area has a ways to go. But we'll get there when we get there. Um, come on, fossils. There we go. There's one. Another great white shark. The sharks spawn pretty frequently, though, like I've noticed. I haven't gone, like, super shark hunting yet, um, just on my own. I did with Odie the other night, but, like, other than that, I haven't really done much with it because I've mostly played the game during the day. But it seemed like they spawned pretty frequently when we were running around the beach, especially, like I said, if you scare off the other fish. Okay, I need one more. And I took this table out. Oh, there it is. I took this table out and I put it in my house uh, because I just don't have the... I, I like this look better. Um, and I don't have enough stuff for this yet. So I just kind of have it fenced off until we get more for it. That is... Oh, no. I, do, I still do have one more. Okay. I have one more fossil yet. Oh, this is a new area! I didn't even talk about this! So this is my toy store area. I wanted to build, like, a little toy store behind, uh, Stitch's house. And it's still kind of a, a work in progress a little bit. But this is definitely, like, the start, at least, to the toy store area that I've been wanting to build. There's Murphy, being a cutie. I already ran this way, didn't I? And I did not see any fossils. I just want to make sure, though. Let's see if there are any sharks. Mm. We'll have to make some fish bait, too, because I have not... Oh, you're coming? Okay, good. Do it, Odie. Alright, I won't look for sharks then, because that's kind of pointless. And I've cut off a lot of these rivers, like, I've made weird little walkways through them because I'm like, I don't want to mess with building bridges every five minutes, so I'm just not going to. So, that's kind of been my idea with that. I cannot find this other fossil. I guess I haven't run down in, like, the main area yet. I don't know. Oh, I didn't even talk about my house either. I redid the outside of my house. It's totally different, too. Um, I tried to make it a lot more of, like, a little farm. So, yeah. I have, like, three different gardens going on in here. So. Three different gardens, girl! You haven't even found a scorpion yet? I found it, like, day one. Like, so quickly. But yeah. So, pretty hot. Um, so while Odie's on his way, I'll go ahead and uh, do the song entry. If you have a KK song in mind, go ahead and type, don't type that, type the word song into the chat. Um, and your KK song may just be picked. So, make sure you have a real song idea, though. None of these phony song ideas that don't exist. You know what I'm saying? So, and as soon as Odie gets here, we'll go ahead and pick. So, um, and capitalization doesn't matter. It's not, like, case sensitive or anything. All right. So let's do this. Check-in is gonna pick our song for the night. So check-in, go for it. Big check-in winning. KK song! Is that a... It, wait, what's KK song? I don't even know what it is. Good. We'll get to hear it. So Odie, you gotta come over and join us for a song. So first things first, you have to endure a song before you can go buy that freaking warrior. Oh, you waved to us. Hi, Odie. Um, okay, give me that one song. KK song. It's a song! 
I'll probably, once I hear it, I'll know it, but like, until then, I'm just gonna be unfamiliar. Okay, K, K, no. And then, song. Perfect. Well, the good news is we know we don't have this one. Alright, so I'm gonna turn myself like way down and then I'm gonna turn KK way up. Oh, but Big Snacko is in the house. What's up, Snack Attack? And Big uh, Flaming Shy Guy, welcome to the stream. Okay, hold on. So let me turn myself. What an experience. Hope you guys enjoyed that. All right, well thank you KK for that really exciting uh, 10 out of 10 song and thank you check-in for the request. Uh, so naturally we have to go put it in the music player over here. Oh, never mind. I don't have any songs to register. Why not? Why? Uh... Probably because Odie's here. I know I don't have it already. Freaking Odie being a widely accepted ruiner. Anyway. Um, oh yeah, it's getting mailed to me. Okay, good. I've only done that like one other time, so I couldn't remember. Oh, what's up, girl? Yes. Let's talk. Yeah, I need to get some stuff out of my storage and actually, like, give it to the villagers. <gasps> you met Tutu! Oh, it's Renee! I always get their names mixed up. They're both rhinos, they're both girly, and they both have freaking R names. I never know which one's which. Tutu's home. I love Tutu. <laughs> Momo, we need to have a serious talk. No! One is- it doesn't matter! They're both cuties! Alright, what's the- oh, well, her shirt matches the inside of her ears! How cute! Aw, Tutu has a chance to build her fan base with Odie. I heard about this the other night and was outraged! Oh my god, no! Um... 
fuck? What are you talking about? I passed on the Tam, the Tam O'Shanter or whatever, like a month and a half ago. Tamal was the last one to have it. I don't know. Yeah, Tamal was the. I left it in Tamal's ha town, and he found it. And I have no idea where it is now. <laughs> Yeah, pick, that was the night- snack! That was the night you were on the pier fishing and we were all behind you acting dumb. I buried it in his town that night. That was like, weeks ago. So. Look at you just blaming the wrong person, okay? <laughs> it's not me, I already passed it on. Anyway. Uh, Odie, where did you go? No, I definitely don't still have it. I have not had it since that night, so... No. I have no idea where Odie is, and he's not saying anything in the chat either, so... Maybe he's in Red's place? I don't know. I'm sure you're, like, outraged and no one knew. Nobody knew this? Tamal! Every- so many people were there that night. I am disappointed. Oh, welcome, cousin. Yay! Uh... Hot. Um... You just need to buy this guy. So, by the big man. Yeah. <laughs> can I check the painting, uh, the girl in the pearl earring? I can. But not until Odie's done. But yeah. Um. Oh yeah, if you try to get rid of a neighbor by reporting them to Isabel, it actually doesn't do anything. That only is valid if they are like saying something really inappropriate like if their catchphrase is something stupid or inappropriate you can like report it to isabel and she'll put it back to the default that's all that does so or if they're yeah or if they're wearing like a an offensive design or something you can report it but yeah you can only report sad bulge <laughs> oh I don't know. Odie, what are you doing? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if you- I've never wanted any of the other stuff in here, so I- If you want any of it and he lets you buy it, go for it, because I don't want it. Um, you with that freaking slide walk. Okay, so let's go ahead and look at Girl of the Pearl Earring. I'll take a look. Yeah. I don't know- I feel like the subtlety of her fakeness is- I would have to look it up. How do I zoom in? I don't know. Um. Yeah, I- to be fair, I'm with you, Snack. I honestly like that the villagers are- you can keep the villagers easier in this one. Because every five seconds people would move out in the other games and it bugged the crap out of me. Um, this is the one Monkey gave you that he thought was real but was fake? I don't- I feel like the- I feel like it is real, but like, uh... The fake one has a different earring, like a- I think you're right, Alexa. I think it does have, um, it has, like, a star or something. It's, like, a weird shape. That's weird that three of these pieces are real. Alright, well, Pix, come on over and get this girl with a pearl earring for me. <laughs> uh. That's really funny. Um... Dang it, Pix! But I need you to come over. Yeah, so Snack, you buy it. I don't think Snack's one of my best friends on here, though. And I only have my thing open to best friend -os. 
Yeah, snack, come on over and buy this painting for me. I don't think so. Whatever, fine. Let's see if Fridge will sit on her toilet again. She likes to do that to us. All right, thanks, Pix. Uh, but, like, I do want to be Bobo's best friend. I want to be your best friend too, Snack. But, like, I don't think I've ever visited you or you visited me on... I, number one, I don't think I've ever visited you, period. But number two, I don't think you've ever visited this town. Only my other one. So... Should I put a toilet in the wedding photo? For sure, girl. All right, she's coming. Here she goes. Yeah. Do it. No. Come on, Fridja. Oh, shoot. Oh, dang it. We were so close. Come on. It's calling your name. Let's go, Fridja. Let's go. She's thinking about it. I can tell. Why is she not doing this? Freaking Pixie came over secretly the other night. Not fair. She's like, she is. She's like, should I do it? Fridja, come on. This is your call to fame. I'm trying to push her into it. I need you to go on that toilet. Oh, freaking. Here, maybe she'll get jealous after I use it. Come on, Fridja, I'm waiting. She's being so stubborn tonight. Usually she's all about that toilet, but I guess not tonight. All right. I see. Guess it makes sense. Solid. I've given her such dumb stuff. Um, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, show her how it's done. I tried. She didn't go for it. She did not go for it, unfortunately. All right, let's see if we can find some Sharkos really quick. I'm pretty uncomp with this. Every Snack, every time we go in her house, she's either on the toilet or she has somebody over and they're on the toilet. So, like, I was sure that if we went over there, she would do it again, but she just, she let us down. So, can I please get, get this fish out of here? Thank you. I'm like trying to scare these dang fish away. There we go. I need to dig up some fish bait so we can really go like... No, shark fishing. I know, I need to take a photo of every villager on the toilet. I have quite a few, cause I have Biscuit, he was over at Cherry's house getting on the toilet nonstop. Um, and then I have Stitches on the toilet at Fridges. Fridge on the toilet at Fridges. I have like all these toilet photos. It's pretty amazing. It's a collection. So, oh, here comes Big Pigs. What I really don't like is that this fish bait, like, or these clams or whatever, don't stack. Unless they change that in an update, which they didn't. So cool. Thanks for that game. I know, party in the bathroom! Um, I also need to be looking for, for fish bait. Fish bait! Um... I'm still missing a bunch of gifts for people, too, so once I go back to my house, I'm gonna take care of that. What did I just do? Not one of those. Oh. Well, JK, I didn't even realize that was a thing, but okay. I mean, I'm sure I did that in my other town, but 
Um, Reese by Sharks for a premium. What's not to love? Um, I just really don't like Cyrus. Please close the window. I'm sorry. I had to dig up that clam. <laughs> to uh, dig up that clam. Yes, you can put houses on the beach. Ah, fusion, Florexy. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the pimp zone, girl. Here comes big picks. A total shell arena. Yes, girl. Um, so Pix is gonna get that girl with the pearl ear earring painting for us. <laughs> uh, but yeah, pretty hot. Ah. <laughs> I'm doing well, how are you, Fusion? And John Jimenez, how's it going? I probably said that wrong, but that's just how I roll. Oh, Pixie, look at that beach look, yes. Can I come over by your art and then ignore you and fish? Totally snack, if we were besties. Which I would totally be your bestie if it didn't require you to have been here already. <laughs> um, so what's the dating situation? Well, currently, uh, Cherry is really into Biscuit, but he's totally oblivious. And we tried to put Tank and Rhonda together. However, I think Tank and Tutu were kind of interested in each other. And I... I think that's it. I don't think anybody else has really been established. So. I think we're just missing some, you know, coolness. Oh, yes! Look at that eel. The uh, Is that the Amora eel or whatever? I caught one of those the other night. Um, oh, Roscoe and Phoebe revealed themselves to be besties. Yes! Oh, look! Cookie's got her little apron on in the cat cafe. How cute. Alright, nice to see you, Prof Pie. It's cloudy. I'm not a fan. But you know, clouds aren't so bad if you talk to them with... Oh. Okay. Anyway. Oh, sweet! There's that other fossil. <laughs> oh... Yeah. <laughs> Stu and Allie are the lovebirds on your island. Hot. Gotta go for all these hot dates. Oh, 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 oh! There we go. <laughs> um. I mean, that's an easy fix, Phantom, so... On your island, Eric and Rald are together. Aw, how cute! I love how on Odie's Town, he also has Eric, and he's always on a snack break. And I'm like, the irony. The irony. Um, get this freaking sea bass out of here. I'm trying to scare off all these people. And I'm just trying to collect fish bait. So yeah. Um. I cannot, come on, get out. There we go. There's seriously no, there are no clams. Why? Uh, you finally finished all fossil, and all fossils? Nice! I'm still trying to finish all my fossils in both of my towns. 
The other town, I think I'm missing, like, my main town, I think I'm missing, like, one or two. But I, like, never find them. It, it's been, like, weeks of not finding anything new. So. But, yeah. So. Uh, I guess I could go back to my house and get out, um some gifts to give my villagers. So we've just seen a bunch and we haven't had anything to give them. Okay. So. Uh, how do you change your name? Uh, like on Twitch? I think you have to like submit a name change. I don't think you can just do it like spontaneously. I think you have to like submit it to Twitch and then they approve it and... I think it's a whole process, but I don't know how to do it because I've never, I've never done it. I, yeah, I would Google how to do that. Um, are you blaming Shy Guy? I know all about name changes. It is a process. I do know that much. Um, this guy, no, whatever. Okay, I'm gonna go back to my house really quickly and grab some stuff out of my storage. How I get- did- yeah, I gave Tutu the shirt. I think I'm gonna give my hamster, for as funny as that sounds, I'm gonna give my hamster to Cookie because it doesn't really fit in our- like, it's not gonna fit in our mean girl's room because she doesn't have a hamster. I'll give the soft serve lamp away. You know what? I'm going to give the mini fridge away just because I don't think that's going to really work up there either. I think it needs to be classier. I just went through clothes. Um, so, but yeah. Uh, I, yeah, I think I just went through this. Look at how cute this is. I have egg sushi costume and I have... Tutu gave this to me the other day. A soft serve hat. I'm like, mm, those are hot. Yes, girl. I feel like I could probably give that away. Um, hmm. Alright, I think that's enough for people. So... Yes! That tiger shirt! That is majestic. It's like a tiger shirt dress. Like, it's so, so cool. It's big hot. Okay, I'm gonna go back to Cookie. No! She left! Oh, there she is. Okay. Why is she not here? Uh, this is for you. And we're gonna give her this hamster, because it's pink. No, Pixie! Do not shovel cookie. Cookie? I almost cooking, so I was like, cookie. Um, but yeah. Okay, thanks for not giving me anything in return. You guys suck. I hate how these neighbors are like, oh, I love it, but I'm not gonna give you anything for it, because I hate you. So cool. Tutu, you're so cute! Did I give Biscuit something earlier? Because Biscuit was building a golden stag beetle or whatever. Oh, I didn't give him anything. Okay, I'm giving you... I'm gonna do this crap because it's boring and your house is pretty boring. Oh, it's a candle. Ugh. Um, but yeah. I know, her little snowball looking tail. It's so cute. So, so cute. John Jim Jimmins, I, you need to Google it. Like, that's not really what, people aren't really here to solve your name change issue. So like, you should probably Google that crap. That would be the smart thing to do rather than badger people in the chat to like, tell you what the settings are. <laughs> Thanks, what are you saying, Rex? But, 
Yeah, this isn't Madam Tech stream. We've already we've already talked about this. I'm not tech support, guys. I don't know. People must look at me and be like, oh my god, this girl is tech. And it's like, no, if you want tech support, like, get out. I don't have time for this. So. Okay, well, I'm on a ZTE. Um, you need to, like, get out, so. Timing you out, boy. Maybe in this 10 minutes that you're timed out, you will learn how to use Google. <laughs> um, anyway. Oh, that's what I, I thought. I thought so, Snack. I thought you were like, now listen, I, when I look at this girl, <laughs> oh my god, this girl is tech. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Hey Rhonda, take this crap. Um Soft serve lamp mini fridge. Oh the mini fridge. Well, no, she needs this casual chic dress, because I don't know why she's wearing this sweater. So Yay! It looks so good on her. Finally, she gives us something. Um but you know. <laughs> Oh, uh, what is what what's going on right here? We have a tea dress, a tea dress, and fish bait. Are these for me picks or are these for not me? What you do, Stitch? Big old Stitch. Let's go. I'm giving you. Oh, soft serve lamp would be cute in his house. Oh, dresses are from you. Oh well, thank you. I just saw Pixie standing there, so I was like, what? Oh, well, thanks for the bait. I appreciate that. Oh, solid cycling shirt. I feel like they're just giving me back crap that I've given them now. Like, I definitely gave him that cycling shirt. I definitely gave other people fun stuff. Um, let's see, tea dress. What does it say on it? I don't know. The one had, like, print on it. Hold on, I'll go in Murphy's house and figure it out. <laughs> Dresses are from me, but, like, they were from me. What? I don't understand. Oh, wait. I still don't. Oh, sea lion! I was like, am I just not able to understand what is happening? Wow. What a hot Murphy photo. Oh, I was really ready for my Nook phone to be like, oh my god, you took a photo! Alright, you gotta love Murph. Alright. Uh, I'm putting my shell dress back on because it's cuter. Sorry. Sorry about your luck. Um. <laughs> but no, I'm serious. Thank you for the dresses. I just, I love my shell dress. I'm trying to get all the, like, yellow summer stuff. So that way I have, like, one color I'm focused on. And, yeah. Oh, I didn't even, there was a hydrate, like, five minutes ago. So everybody take a drink. Sorry, madam, but these are not your average points. Isn't Murphy the cutest? I love him. I need to... Did I miss anybody? I don't think I did. I think I gave everybody a gift now. I think. Oh, nice! Big Mahi Mahi hype! The only fish I missed in May was the giant Trevally, and I don't think you can get it anymore, so that kind of sucks. I definitely got a Mahi Mahi, but- oh, Nice! What's that? It's a baby. Why am I, like, not clapping in the direction of you? Um... <laughs> I have a beer ch sip. <laughs> what? <laughs> Quick, take a drink. Yeah. It's funny, whenever I take a drink of, like, soda or something, it's like- I feel like- It's like I'm getting dehydrated, but it's okay. Oh, it was your dinner. Yes, a beer and a veggie burger. That sounds really lovely, actually. I hope your bun wasn't green like mine the other day. 
and I hope you, if it was, that you realized it before you ate it. So, that was super fun. I made a ve veggie burger two days ago, and I got down to, like, the last three bites and looked down, and my, the bottom of my bun was green. So I was like, hmm, hot. Awesome. I love feeling like I'm gonna die, because I just ate mold, but that's cool. Only, like, I didn't actually feel like I was gonna die. It was just disgusting, so... <laughs> All right, we'll have to save the mini fridge for next time. Now I gotta make all these fish baits. Um, so I'm gonna go back here. I didn't mean to eat mold. I think it was on that end piece and like, I just, I mean, just because it wasn't green doesn't mean there wasn't mold throughout, but you know. Um. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm sorry. Um, okay, so I need to make fish bait. So that I can finish. Thank you. <laughs> oh. Yeah. JG is the boss, how's it going? We're just making fish bait one at a time because that's how it's done. I ate the last of my leftovers before my stream. The last of my tortellini. It takes so long to do this, like one at a time. It's so annoying. I still want to get, like, I, I think tomorrow maybe I'll get sushi. Because it sounds so good, but... You know, it always sounds good, and then I, like, never do anything about it. Although I did finally get it the other day, like, when I was whining about it, and like, oh my god, it sounds so good, you guys. I did finally get it the other day. So. That is hype. Okay, so we have ten fish bait. Cool. I want sushi, but, um... Yeah, so I had sushi finally, like, I think it was last week or something, but still not from the restaurant I've been trying to order from because they just hate me. Um, I, I want sushi, but I don't like to order it in, so, like, never getting it, smile. Hot. Um, I order carry-out sushi all the time, usually, but... You know, like I said before, my luck with sushi has been like, I call, I called at like eight o'clock or nine, I think it was like nine o'clock because they said they were open till 9.30 and I was like, yo, I'm starving, I'm gonna be that person. So I called and they're like, they answer the phone and are like, oh, um, yeah, we closed an hour ago. And I'm like, why are you answering the phone if you closed an hour ago? And then I freaking called again like the next day oh whoa look at this girl um such a different look uh so i called again like a few days later and they're like spontaneously closed on a random tuesday i'm like cool so it was really dumb anyway um What was I doing out here? I don't know. I've seen zero sharks since we actually started looking for them. So poop. But yeah, shout out to Odie and Pixie for coming over and getting the artwork for me. Big appreciate. Mm. Get out of here, bass! Bass! See, they won't- you can run in front of them and they just will not take a hint. Ah! King Peachy! Thank you for the follow! Welcome to the pimp zone. Um... Oh, Cole! Cole, thank you so much for the subscription! Sub hype! I thought of something funnier than 24. 
over two years man, and I love every second of it. Keep up the amazing work, you fear is a pimp. Your fear are safe, pimp. Thank you so much, Cole. You are so sweet. Thank you for all your support, and you're always so kind in your messages. Giving it a ba, a ba, and a ba from check in and also giving you all the bars from the Ba family welcome back cole thank you so much uh and my dream villager my favorite villager in the world is pinky so i guess she'd be my dream villager oh wow sweet sweet job fishing that was super fun um it lasted a whole one fish so i hate that the tools break like i hate it i hate it um, but yeah, I had Pinky in my original Animal Crossing town on the GameCube, and then she moved to, like, my Let's Play town when I started doing a Let's Play, and I just fell in love with her and have been obsessed with her, but I've not gotten her randomly in a town since. Um, I did eventually use an amiibo card. One of my friends had her in New Leaf, and she moved out, and I got her. And then I used an amiibo card, I think, for the other town, um, which I don't like doing. I hate doing that because it's so freaking annoying. And you can't find it on Google? Okay, well then, I don't know. Take your drama somewhere else. Okay, so anyway, I wanted to not use any amiibo cards for this so that way that like it stays random and that way we can just like get who we get and have fun with it so waluigi girl thank you for the host but yeah if we found her i would be like oh yes my favorite villager we've found so far has been tutu because i've never had her in any town until this so um okay I got my fishing rod. I don't even think I looked at what fishing rod was for sale in here today, so. <laughs> it pro Phantom, it probably wouldn't be as dramatic as in my original GameCube series, in all honesty. Like, I would be very, very excited. Don't get me wrong, but I don't think anything could be as dramatic as that. No, I don't want to buy like four million of these. I just want one. Um, but yeah. So. <laughs> it wasn't too dramatic. It was 100% myself as a 19 year old, but you know, I'm like 29 now and it's like, you know, when you're 19, I think that fictional pandas are, fictional cartoon pandas are more exuberant than when you're 29 and you've, like, seen said panda for, like, a million years, so. <laughs> I love her, but it probably wouldn't be as, as high for as a, a big of a letdown as that probably is. So. Everyone's 19 at some point. True. Yeah, I was 19 during that project, young madam. No, I don't. I do not want to place this. I don't know that this is in the museum yet, so I need to store it. Um, but yeah. <laughs> uh, I was nine when you started your YouTube channel. 10 years older than you, Cole. You're now my 19. Now, see, Cole, now you know. Now you're like, hey, I'm 19. I have the super hype over the fictional pandas. And, well, whatever. I'm 29 and a half, honey. So, still 10 years older than you. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so now you're like, I get it. But in 10 years, you're, you're going to be like, oh. That's super fun, but, like, probably not going to react to it the same way. I also wanted to marry, like, an anime character when I was, like, 16, 17 years old. So, like, you know, I, I since decided that I wanted to marry Odie instead, and I think that's a better option. Because it's real life. So, I'm like, mm-hmm, that's probably a better way to go about this. So, <laughs> so yeah. Anyway. <laughs> when 
I was four, I wanted to marry Ariel, still do. <laughs> I mean, I can't say I don't. Yeah, good choice. True. Now, maybe Odin is an anime character. That, it, it could be true. But, you know. He's real enough, I guess. What is this money? Anyway. Um. What, 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 hold the phone. None of this I'm a guy BS, okay? You come into this chat, you're a girl. I don't care what you identify as. I don't care what your like PC preferences, like we're having fun here. Uh, you're either a girl, or you get out. So... <laughs> you know, that's- that's how this goes. Uh, Waluigi girl! Who is an actual girl. Um, thank you so much for that $10 hype! Thank you so much for the donation. Um, you are so sweet and so generous. Always so giving as well. I give you all the bars, pizza, frago, party hats popcorn, and haha -ha balls, because they're rainbow. Uh, thank you so much. You are so sweet. Can you be Birdo? You can absolutely be Birdo, because she's a girl, and she's girl. Um, so, Mega Waluigi, I don't think you do know, because that's not the first time I've seen you say, I'm a guy, and I'm like, you need to get over being a guy and be a girl. Like, I'm sorry. Um, Sugarlips88, er, 88, I'm sorry. Sugarlips98, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so. Wait, found this in my tree. Cute DIY. What? Are you serious? How did you find a cute DIY table in my tree? I never find stuff like this. Um, Armand, you can totally be Daisy, too. I don't care who you are. I'm just gonna call everybody girl. I'm not a guy. I'm a man. Like, I don't get offended when people say, hey, guys. I'm not like, wait. I'm a girl. Like, what? It's slang. Enjoy it. It's fun. It's 2020. Have fun, okay? 2020 is bad enough without your PC. Um, Rosie Summer SX, welcome to the Pimp Zone. Thank you for the follow. Oh, thank you, Odie. Big Sharko. And you, do you have the color? You do. I love the colorful fishing rod because it has a rubber ducky on the end as the bobbin. It makes me very happy. No, don't face the other way. Just dang it. Okay, hold on. Yay! Big shark go! Woo! Oh yay! I haven't gotten a hammerhead yet! Woohoo! Hammerhead sharks are my favorite sharks, by the way. So... Um, hammerheads are the best. Put to the test. Woo! Shark! Scott man, thank you so much for the bits! Um. <laughs> she sounded so, like, disappointed. Whoa. Shark. Oh my god. Thank you so much. Uh, for the bits. And thank you, Odie, for saving that shark for me. I wanted to use some of this fish bait to uh, catch sharkos, but I'll probably go on the pier and do that because I like to fish on the pier because it's hype. You can also find some pretty cool fish on the pier anyway, um, so I'll go ahead and do some of this. Scatter foods. Oh. Oh. Okay, sorry. I'm gonna scare away anything that's not big. It's probably a sea bass, but whatever. We'll go for it. Just because we can. Come on. <laughs> no, it's happening to me. It's gonna be a sea bass. Oh no, it's not. It's a red snapper. Hi. Um, no, what am I doing? I'm not trying to go to that. Okay. Cool. 
What now? What else did I do? Oh, sweet. Okay, bait snatch and frenzy. I think I'm still some kind of grandpa. Uh, a self-possessed self grandpa. I was like, I know I changed it, but I don't remember what I changed it to. But yeah, self-possessed grandpa. It's hot. No. Get out. Okay. So. Cool. Rubber ducky. Nice, you got all the sharks and piranha and tilapia in one night. Awesome. That's usually how I go how I go about it when I fish. I like end up fishing all in one night and getting everything and then like forgetting to fish the rest of the month. So it's the way to go. It's a good way to do things cuz then you know cuz like if you catch it all in one night, then you like you know what you have. Like you, if you catch throughout like time, you forget what you have already caught. I mean, I know it's like, yes, when you catch something new, but like, I don't know. Sometimes I fail to donate things right away, so unless you are like a donor without fail, then to the museum. Pixie's yelling at me! Hot. So. No, get out! Oh, party popper! Yes, pigs. I love this party that just keeps happening on this pier. Um, I, I didn't like fishing in New Leaf, Angelia. I totally get what you're saying. I was a bug catcher all the way in New Leaf, but I actually prefer fishing in this game, which is weird, because most of the time I like bug catching more. So, anyway. So... Yeah, he's being supportive. Big picks. Supportive picks. This is probably some BS fish. Come on, give me something good. Oh. oh squid! Oh well. That's what I get for not, like, just going for big shadows. Come on, shark, come to my bait. Okay, come to my bait. What? Oh, there it is. I was like, lag? This is also not a shark, but that's okay. Um. Frickin' sea bass, just get out! And nook bones, stop going off, I don't care. I say that now, and then later I'll be like, I don't have any Nook Miles! Why not? I just wish it would automatically just add the points. Just add my points up, like, right away. <gasps> oh, Shark Boys! Oh! It's a little one! It's a sucker fish! It's a suck! Sweet. Alright. I'll take it. Wow! Yay, the snakehead! I caught one of those um, yesterday. And I was like really surprised. I'm like, what the heck is this? Alright, cool. Yay! I don't think I clapped for you, but I meant to. There's your applause. What? It wasn't a snakehead? What the heck is that thing? I definitely caught whatever it was. I thought it was called a snakehead. Oh, it's some word I can't pronounce. No wonder. Well, it's in my museum, so go look at it. Look at the big oh my god, get these sea bass out of here. I'm so over the sea bass. Okay. 
That is not a shark. And it doesn't want to leave, so that's even more fun. I'm like tripping over that rock for whatever reason. We're just gonna kind of run around and see what happens. Fireworks, yes, ladies. Oh, look at all the ladies over on this part of the island. Okay, come on. I'm like nowhere near this fish. What am I doing? Oh, Armand, thank you so much for the bits. <laughs> thank you so much. Oh, Cha Cha, thank you so much for the bits. Hi. Um. Oh, sweet. But yeah. Now that fireworks stores are open, I hear them, like, all the time. So. But I can never see them. That's the only thing. I hear them every night, and I can never see them. I'm like, well, poop butt. So. Oh my god, that big, big, fat, fat, fat remix! It's true. It's, it's the true remix. I don't even remember... When did I make that? I think I made that with, uh, I did like a rap battle with my sister at Allison's wedding. That's probably a freaking sea bass. Um, yeah, Little Foo's wedding, I think, is when I made that. Because I know the next part is, you didn't have to scoop my poop. Oh, sweet, another sucka. Um, never heard it until now, I love it. Thanks, Cole. Thanks for the hype. Um, anyway. Come on, sharks, I need, like, more of you to come out. Like, where the F are ya? Oh no, it looks like someone's leaving. It's your favorite alert. Oh, thanks, Armand. Speaking of alerts, you guys, I want to keep reminding people as we've trickled in. Uh, go to my poll right now. It's linked by exclamation alert. And pick which alert you liked best from St. Jude. My whole St. Jude Play Live campaign last month, I had like 20 unique alerts. One's going to stick around. The rest are going to be annual um, for that event. So pick your favorite, and if you weren't there, um, if you don't know all of them, you can go to, there's a video on my YouTube channel, it's like my most recent video, or one of my most recent videos, it's the Madam uh, Plays Mario Party as DK, um, it was the finale stream, and at the end of that video it plays all of them, so like, if you want to watch all of them and get refreshed, or if you don't want to do any of that and you don't know what they are and you just want to pick the name you think is coolest, then do that. Excuse me, and I'm going to hiccup. So. I also need to announce, you guys, that on Monday, I may not be streaming. Um, I'm supposed to, my normal schedule is Monday, Tuesday at 1 p.m. Eastern and Friday, Saturday at 8 p.m. Eastern. But this Monday, I may not be streaming because it'll definitely not be at my normal time if I do because I have to go to a funeral. Um, so, kind of depending on how I feel, I may stream later in the day. But this is like the 13th death in my family in the past five years, so like, I don't know how I'm gonna feel afterward. I don't know if I'm gonna be in the mood to stream, if that'll... So I'm just gonna kind of go by however that is. I'm gonna play it by ear, and um, I might stream that evening at some point, but... Yeah, so that, but the one o'clock stream is definitely not happening, so. Anyway. So that is why I will not be streaming. Okay, what the heck? Why can I not aim in a straight line? So. And I'll, I'll announce that again, oh crap, I'll announce that again at the end, but I just wanted to throw that out there for anybody who's maybe not staying all the way until the end of the stream. 
in case you're on here on Monday and are like, where the heck is she? It's like, oh. But it is, I did list it below. I was like, no, no stream at 1 p.m., maybe stream, or evening stream to be announced. So, um, oh, thank you, Cole. It's, this is on Monday, too, Cole. This isn't on Sunday, but. But thanks, guys. I appreciate your support. Um, and it, it was an older relative, so, like, she lived, like, a long, long life, so it wasn't, it's not, like, a tragic loss from COVID or something, you know what I mean? So, like, um, it, it was pretty expected, so it's, it's not, like, anything crushing. It's just, you know, that it, funerals can be stressful, so I'm, like, I don't want to guarantee anything and then get home and be, like, look, I don't really want to stream, you know what I mean? So... But I might get home and be like, all right, let's go. So I'm just kind of going by in the moment. But Thanks, Quincy Crossing. Quincy, I don't think I said hi to you yet either, but welcome to the stream. And Ryan Mazin as well, welcome to the stream. So we'll just play it by ear. But if you don't see me on Monday, that's why. But I'll definitely be streaming this game again on Tuesday. So, no, no worries there. Um, it's weird because I have not, like, missed a day of streaming in so long. And then obviously, like, I was like, man, I have, like, a good streak going. And it's like, oh, shoot, I have to miss one day. Never mind. <laughs> so. On my, like, regular schedule, I mean. Like, I haven't had to reschedule anything in, like, forever. So, it's kind of crazy. Hi, Odie! <laughs> I can't look at her. I get too, too, uh, paranoid. So. Oh, yes, girl! Big tilapia hype! Woohoo! Look at us with our matching fishing rods. A matching fish. Odie and his rad gravity look. Um. That's true, Cole. Stream streak. I really am on the path to partner right now, too, guys. That is my goal. So, like, thank you so much for being here. I keep... I want to just keep reiterating that. Like, thank you so much for coming out and showing your support. Because the only thing that I'm missing is just numbers. So I'm just trying to work on getting my numbers up. So if you've shown up, thank you so much for helping me to reach that. Um, so. It's big appreciated, for sure. I am a big fan of tilapia as food. You know, God love tilapia. God bless the tilapia. But, like, I... They are one of my favorite fish to eat. <laughs> so, you know. Oh my gosh, there's a Sharko! Okay. Um, your ex-girlfriend's name sounded like Tilapia. <laughs> uh, my fiance's ex-girlfriend's name sounded like a Pokemon, which is like one of my favorite stories to bug him with. Waluigi girl, thank you so much for the sub hype. Uh, <laughs> Ooh, big old great white. Thank you so much, Waluigi girl. You are hype. I give you all the love and all the boss. Thank you so much for your support. Yeah, um, he told me he was going to play. This was when Pokemon Go first came out, and he was like, I'm going to go play Pokemon Go. And I thought he said, I'm going to go. I think he said, I'm going to meet so-and-so and play Pokemon Go. And I was like, I thought he meant, like, I'm gonna go catch. Because this story's hilarious. You're like, I've gotta go. I I thought you were saying you were gonna go to this park to catch a specific Pokemon. And, you know, I wasn't up to date. Like, I hadn't played Gen 4, Gen 5. Like, I played part of Gen 5, but not really. And I was like, okay, so you're gonna go, uh play Pokemon Go and look for that Pokemon. I'm like, I've never heard of that Pokemon before. And he responds with, that's my girlfriend. <laughs> I'm like, 
Oh. Because her name was really bizarre. So I, re I thought she was a Pokemon. And I was like, um, I'm sorry. <laughs> so, you know, but it all worked out because later on in life he realized, like, I was his one true love and was like, oh yeah, I should have been like, I should have dated you sooner. So I was like, yeah, see? I <laughs> he could have been like, cool, this girl's psycho, but instead he realized. So, Asbeth, how's it going? <laughs> uh, I'm just saying, you guys, if you embarrass yourself and then you get somebody alone in the bathroom, like, it's almost a guaranteed win. But, it works out. It's a great method. I Do I recommend it? I don't know. But it worked for me. <laughs> It worked for me, I guess you could say. So, it's pretty hot. Oh, shoot. Keep messing it up. Freaking sea bass. Oh, that's one of the eels. I have not caught one of these in this town yet. Wait, don't, don't leave yet. Wait until I catch this eel. Maybe. There we go. After that story, he's like, I'm out. Okay. Now you can leave, Odie. Now you're good. I got my ribbon eel. My amore eel. I love to call- I just think of the amore eels in Toontown. That's what they remind me of. They're not even, like, the same color, but that's what they remind me of. So... Gotta love them. Anyway. Bye, Odie. Thank you guys for coming over and buying art for me. Big appreciate. Um, okay, I'm going to... I was shark hunting. Now I'm playing Sims 2. That sounds like me. Water pixels. I don't want to wrap things up. I wish I could close my gate from here because I can't donate things with the gate open, but I'll go close it and then I'll donate everything that I have collected. So. Wait, buying art for you? What? No! <laughs> yeah, it's gonna look great in your museums. Thanks, guys. Thanks for nothing. Um... Yeah, please close the gate. Yeah, it's my life summarized as briefly as possible. I know on my backloggery, that's like, it, it always asks, like, what games you're playing. And I have Sims 2 as a game that I'm always playing. I'm like, am I ever not playing this game? Like, it's just always. But Odie, you came to help me! <laughs> um, okay, I'm gonna go grab this stuff. And then we're gonna donate it. And then we probably change the town tune. So if you guys have a town uh, tune idea, we'll do tune this time. So type tune into the chat while I'm donating stuff. And then I'll come back to you. What? I only had one fish in storage? Weird. But I have a bunch of fossils. Woo! And then once we do this, we'll probably go to- we'll change the town tune, then we'll probably go to Harv's Island, because I haven't shown that off yet. So... Um... We'll go for it. I thought I had a notification, like... That I got Nook Miles, but I guess not? So... Yeah. What are you saying? But we went to Odin's Island last week. We also went to your island, Big Picks. Your island's so cute. Odie's like redoing his island right now. Um. Uh, my island is getting there finally. I think 
part of the problem with this game is that once you're on your island all the time, you see your island so often that you're just like, I don't... Does it look good? Like, you can't see it anymore. It just You think it looks way worse than everybody else's because you see it constantly. So it's, like, really hard to be objective. And so every time I go to somebody else's island, I'm like, this is so much more put together. But I think it's just because I constantly am looking at my own island. So I feel like that's just a huge part of that. Um, Kaboomik, you're late. You're fashionably late to the party. Welcome. Oh, I've already donated, like, most of these fish. Oh, I must have already donated that eel, because he's not letting me. So sweet. Um, what time is it? Oh, it's after 10. Okay, well, I guess I'll just hang on to these then until tomorrow, and I can give, um, I can give some of these fish to neighbors if... Oh, I need to see what cute DIY table this is. So, anyway, I want to pet manatee for my pool. <sighs> you know, don't we all? Oh, it's the white one! Cute! Alright, um, oh, look at you, Frigia, just staring out into the ocean. Aww. I love when they give you gifts for, like, talking to them. Like, I'll go talk to Tutu and see. I know we're gonna go to Harv's Island, but I want to talk to Tutu. I'm oh, sweeping the grass again, huh? Hot. I want to talk to Tutu and see if she has anything fun to say. She's, like, my fave day. So. Gonna be up big pits. Oh, I thought you said gonna be at. I said gonna be up it. Um... and she's not outside of her house. Where did she go? All right, well, if she's not out, then never mind. We'll go to Harv's Island. Okay. So this is the wedding stuff. I've done this a couple times. Like I said, I'm apparently worse at it than I thought I would be because they give me, like, two points every time. But, you know. Whoa, it's Big Bree in the house. How's it going? All right, so you can do this every day and the theme will be different every day. But, uh, and there will be new furniture pieces added every day too. But yeah. Otherwise it's kind of the same thing. Whoa, girl. Oh, Corazon Peach with the raid. Thank you so much for raiding! Oh, Welcome to the stream! <laughs> Aw, thank you for the follow! Uh, Legginger? I think that's how you say that anyway. Thank you so much! And Corazon, thank you so much for following the other day. You are so sweet. Rones, welcome raiders! We're just about to go to this wedding nonsense, so... Um, thank you for the follow, Joe TQZuna. Uh, Blue Fruit, let's see, Essence Bran, uh, Rones, Corazon Peach, my girl, uh, <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you guys so much for the rate, call me Joe, okay, Joe is easier, thank you so much, you guys, we had somebody in here earlier that was like, how do I change my Twitch name, and I'm like, I don't know, I'm not tech support girl, so that was fun. So I timed him out and I was like, take this 10 minutes to like use Google. And this person came back. They're like, I Googled, I couldn't figure. I'm like, can you <laughs> get out? <laughs> so <laughs> I don't know. That was a fun thing that happened today. But yeah. But oh, thank you so much for the raid. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I was so over it. I'm like, no, I cannot deal with this. I had somebody here the other day that was like asking me to like solve the tech issues with their internet. And I'm like, I don't know why people look at me and think I'm like this tech person. Like, I don't know. 
<laughs> I'm playing Animal Crossing. I'm playing Mario Party. I'm not like building a computer. Like it's it's so funny, but um. Aw, oh, thanks, girl. <laughs> I'm trying, I guess. So, aw, oh, thank you! My sister, Madame Toadstool, actually designed those sub-badges. She designed- I was like, I want the star spirits. We need some hype. And so, that's my favorite. But... <laughs> but thank you. I love her too, period! <laughs> yeah. So shout out to Big MT, shout out to Corazon Peach. If you guys aren't following, Epic Streamer does super cute, super fun streams. I think the first stream I ever went to of yours, you were doing like a, you were doing a cosplay contest and like half the people were not following the rules and it was just like the funniest thing. Not because like they weren't following the rules but because your reaction was really funny. So I was like, all right, let's go. <laughs> Yes, you are. You're epic. I don't care what you say. Okay, what am I doing? I don't know what she said to do, so I'm just gonna do what I always do and make a mess and she's gonna hate it, but that's okay. Uh, She's always like, that's not what I wanted. And I'm like, well, sorry that I don't have the same taste as you. I put every single one of these things in here. I make this look so bad every day, you guys. Every day. It's bad. So. <laughs> Head a who? Just give him like five yeah, wedding yeah. cakes. Stand up, stand up, oh, Kaboomek! With the off. gift yeah, subs! Yeah, Thank you so much for all the gift uh, subs, Kaboomek! You are the best! Um. Dawn, very impressive. King Lizardin, Cody Crossing, Rones, welcome to the Ba family. Thank you so much, Kabumek. You are so sweet. Okay, I sorry, I accidentally snuck in some Doritos. Um, thank you so much for the gift subs. And Dawn, thank you for the follow, girl. Welcome to the pimp zone. Okay, I I would never do this at an actual wedding venue. <laughs> Put swags like on the curtains. Um, yeah, Ninja Doritos. Those Doritos just finding their way in. Oh, look at how cute that is. It like decorated these tables for me. Okay, good. I need another table so I can put candles on it. The game's doing my job for me. Thanks. Appreciate it. Yes. Um, we'll put these benches. No, we'll put these benches in the back for back row Betty, and then we'll put these chairs up here for front row Frida. Actually, we need to get some of those tables out too. Uh, fine, get the f over. I'm done. I need to look at the customization for this stuff too, because apparently I just didn't try and I didn't know it was a thing. So, once we go back home, I'm gonna try and add some customization to some of this crap. Dang it, I added one too many chairs. So anyway, this is the wedding stuff. It's super cute super fun, even though I'm not the biggest fan of Cyrus and Reese, which I wish I was because they're like such a cute design, but like I just do not like their personalities. They're like, no, especially Cyrus. He's so rude. I don't know. He rubbed me the wrong way in New Leaf and I never forgave him. So, um, okay. I don't even know that that's even. So we've got these tables. Um, Oh, are you serious? Look at the hacks. What? I didn't know this. I've been playing this game Ghetto Fabulous for like the past forever. Oh, Psycho Nacho Man, welcome to the stream. And thank you so much for the boots. <laughs> Hi, Super Nintendo Chalmers. Oh, thank you so much for the... For the bits. For the hot super intent tent bit um 
Okay. Fireworks. I can hear them, but I can't see them. Okay, so let me go ahead and look at... Are the customization... No. No! Okay, this is why I don't do well with this photo session. Because I'm really impatient with it. Yeah, I had no idea you could do that with customization options. I would have been doing that so freaking often if I'd known. But I just didn't, so... Um... Keep it in the cute theme, though, right now, so we get max points. Okay. Will do. I didn't realize that you could just change it like that. I am like a noob. Unintentional noob. So it's basically like the same three themes, no matter what. Cute, chic, garden. How cute is that? Yeah, chic and garden. I see. So yeah, you can have like a garden wedding, you can have a chic wedding, like a church wedding. Cute. I mean, the cute is totally like my aesthetic in real life. I I was kind of hoping it would have like the same variations as the cute furniture does. Um, how, you know, you have like the pink, yellow, I mean technically pink is white, but like the white, yellow, red, blue. Um, light blue, like, I wish that that was a thing, but. Uh, do y'all remember the pic where it was like, this is my friend Becky. She was, wait, what? Oh my god, what? I do not remember that, but, wow. Is the game capture being weird or is it just on my end? I don't, I, I don't see anything on my preview window. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure, Pix. Is it being weird for anybody else? Oh, it's done some stuttering for you? It's being a little weird? What, what exactly is it doing? Oh, I see what it's doing. Yeah, what the heck? I don't know why it's doing that. Um... We'll just, we'll keep an eye on it until we're done with this, like, Cyrus and Reese stuff. Maybe it was when I was standing still? I don't know, that's weird. Maybe it was just a little hiccup. Um, good now, for now anyway. Okay, well, we'll keep an eye on it. Okay, do I need to do more than this? I guess I'll put swag on the walls over here. Maybe put swag on the walls and see how that goes um because i don't know why it was doing the little freezies but it was so all right we're gonna put all the swag on the curtains even though like i said i would never do this in real life and we're gonna go with it um but yeah okay well hopefully she likes this or else they're full of BS. Oh, not yet. I want to take pictures first. Okay. So now it's ready. Um. I'm gonna just. Yeah. And she's always like, Did you take more than one? Uh, they're not even like facing each other. Oh well. That's a great photo. Oh, she's blinking in it. No. Let's get a creeper photo where I'm just looking into Cyrus's eyes. Awesome. Okay, great. Yay! Yay! She liked it! Um, okay. 
Woohoo! Wedding head table! Let's go! Alright, so anyway. Again, I don't really care what the photos look like. I just want the crystals so I can get the furniture. <laughs> so. I want the wedding dress. I want the outfit more than the furniture. Okay, so I don't know how many crystals. She gave me 11. Excuse me. 11. I have like 16 at home. Two. I guess I should have like actually brought those with me, but I'll just bring them back later. It's no big deal. I need to get a wedding cake. So let's get that. And... I could get some chairs, I guess? I haven't made it to this stuff yet, but it seems like such a weird concept to me. I mean, like, I just wish it was, like... I don't know. I, I get it, but at the same time, it's, like, too much work. I'm, like, I'm too, like... I just want to get my stuff and go. Okay, I'm gonna get two chairs, because I really need, like, four, but I have more crystals at home. So. Yeah, you love a good cake! So. Uh, but yeah. Alright, give me another chair. I think the wallpapers and stuff are, like, weirdly expensive. I don't really know why, either. I'm just like, okay. They're, like, 12. I'm like, you can't even get that with, like, one visit. Um, the candles are cute, too. Let me see what everything's price is. Uh, so... I have the bench. I think I have two benches. I have a table. I have two chairs. I need two more. I need to get the candle set. Yeah, these are like 12 each. The rug is four, but everything else is like 12. I guess the white wedding wall... I don't know. White wedding wall is the only one I really like, though. And even it could be better. I wish it was, like, colorful, like, stained glass or something. Um. But, yeah. The likelihood of me having a wedding in real life is very low, so I'm probably biased. No! <laughs> oh. Anyway. Well, I just don't like these characters, so that's why I'm biased. I hope that the wall comes in. What What is he doing? Yoga out here? Harvey, you're so freaking weird. Okay, I'm ready to go for delivery. Go for liquidation. I'm ready to go home. I don't even know what it is. I like never come to this island. Pretty much. So Harvey creeps me out too. I am not a fan of Harvey. Like, yeah. I want to get invited to weddings. I want that reception food. Most of the time, I do not want that reception food. So many weddings I've been to have the worst food I've ever tasted in my life. Like, it's so bad. Luckily, the wedding venue I worked at, they actually had really good food. Oh, psycho! Girl! <laughs> thank you so much for- Girl, thank you so much for the donation! Um, you are super sweet. Vape Nation donation. Thank you so much. I give you all the bars. I give you some pizza, some gingerbread men, some doggos, and some bops. Thank you so much for the donation. Um, and big ceilings in the house. So, 4133. Thank you guys so much. Like, you guys are awesome. Sorry, I'm being really loud by, like, banging my fist on the desk. I'm not trying to do that. Uh, thank you so much. But yeah, I... The wedding venue I worked at actually had really good wedding food. It wasn't a matter of it being, like, good or bad. It was just I got sick of it because, uh, our meals were included. That was really nice. Working there, all meals were included. If you wanted something else, you could go get it. But, like... What is this party happening over here? Are you serious? I'm joining this party. Let's do a rando. Um, but yeah. Okay, I'll leave it up to you. Give us a good one. I'm sitting next to Toots. I love Tutu so much. Oh, KK March, I love this one! Um, 
Good night, Mega Waluigi. But yeah, I just like our food was actually pretty good. So I'm like, yes. Oh, this is so cute. I love KK March. I'm like, did we hear this last week? No, we did KK Mouse. Aww. See, where are all these cuties when I'm trying to, like, have the actual concert where I get, like, a bootleg copy? Like, where is this happening? Um. But, yeah. I don't even know. Wait, what just happened? How is the... How is the donation bar... Oh, Mr. Wario, thank you for the... I was like, how is the donation bar higher now? Thank you so much for the extra dollar and 51 cents, girl. Thank you for the donation hype. Um, I mean, it, it feels like yesterday I was donating to St. Jude. It honestly was almost yesterday. Um... So, that's- that's very true. Aw, thank you so much. Thank you for the donation hype. I'll give you some buzz, girl. Um. <laughs> I wanna have- I remember when I worked at that wedding venue, it was like, I would have people come in, I'd be like one of the people they'd come up to and be like, Hey, where do I set this up? And one of the people- came in and they were like, hey, I'm here for the donut bar. And I was like, right here. And she's, she laughed. I'm like, okay, yeah, just leave it here. I'll take care of it. And then, you know, you know, later you can just explain like, oh yeah, I gave it to this girl and she took care of it. Sorry, it didn't ever make it up to you. Um, but it was cool to go in the rooms, like the reception rooms and see stuff all like set up. Oh. That donut bar looked so good. I was like, oh man, but they're gonna see like, oh, this this like worker went and snagged a donut. <laughs> so, uh, the unicorn is Julian. Julian is our hot gay neighbor who has a gay club outside of his house because we love him. So, and it's also our runway for when we have fashion shows. So yay. Yeah, this is the outside of Julian's house. And then, this is Julian's house. I kind of wish Julian's house was more colorful on the outside. But yeah. Um, I know a lot of people have candy bars. Like, my girl, Little Foo, had a candy bar at her wedding. But hers was, like, right before Halloween, so it was perfect. Um, and, yeah. I really want to have, my church does a hot mashed potato bar, like, oh my god. After events, they'll have like a mashed potato bar, and I'm like, I think I need to steal this. Like, that's hype, so. But I do want my wedding to be entirely vegetarian, so I'm probably going to end up doing like Italian or pizza. I don't care I, if all these like 10 things you shouldn't serve here. I'm like, mm -mm, pizza's my favorite food. We're having freaking pizza. Okay. So I honestly understand why people would crash weddings. Oh my God. Uh, the other weddings I went to, there's a barn in the mountains. Wait, what? Hold on. Barn in the mountains. Everyone got drunk and then went to this giant bonfire where your aunt blamed her. <laughs> Shoes for being the reason why she was stumbling around. Wow. Um, I've crashed many weddings thanks to that wedding job, but you know, man, those the cake. I would get the cake. Oh, sweet. Um, hopefully, no one crashes my wedding. You have to crash, like, a big wedding, though. I was paid to be a wedding crasher once. Uh, these people had, like, a, you know, 
$500,000 wedding or whatever, and uh, they hired dancers to, like, keep the dance floor going. My sister was actually hired for the same job, and it was on New Year's Eve, and it was the weirdest thing I've ever done. Like, we had to do Thriller at midnight and be, like, zombies, so we had to change outfits. We were, like, normal, uh, wedding goers, so it was weird, because we were, like, at the ceremony, and... This is so stupid, too. Me and my sister had these two guys come up to us, and it was like a movie moment. Like, this is something I've never had happen to me in real life. Like, and I was like, oh, this only happens in movies. And we had these two guys come up and be like, hey, uh, how do you know what's her face? And I was like, oh, we were college friends. <laughs> like, we had this whole backstory written for this girl that we did not know, but we were, like, performing at her wedding. And we were like, yeah, we were college friends with her. And they're like, are you guys twins? And we're like, yeah. Even though we're four years apart and there's a sister in between us, we just played it off. We're like, oh, totally. And um, so then they asked us, they were like, well, you want to get out of here? And I'm like, I can't. I'm, I want to see what happens. Like, we were so, like, we had to, like, make up the weirdest stories for, like, why we couldn't leave. It's like, I kind of want to see what they do at midnight. <laughs> Yeah, born four years apart, totally twins. Oh, solid, um, tire, hot. Yeah, sorry, I'm sleeping. No, the choreographer was fantastic. I love her to death. She is a sweetheart. It was the guy in charge. The guy who was like the coordinator or whatever, he was a nightmare. He was the creepiest guy I've ever met. And he used the word stoked, every other word. And he was like six, I don't know how old he was. He was like 75 years old, but he'd had so much plastic surgery, I couldn't really tell. And like, he, he was like, I'm so stoked about this. And like, our first meeting with him, he started talking about pot brownies. And he's like, you know, you gotta be careful with wedding food because, you know, you don't want to serve the wrong thing. And then, you know, you serve something that's got some substance and then you get the munchies and you want more. And we're all just sitting there like, what is happening? Like, who is- like, he was on every drug that exists. I'm convinced. This was a wedding that- I, this was a wedding I was paid to perform at, Snack. My sister and I were hired to be dancers to keep the dance floor going. It was like Allison's wedding, but we were paid to do it, not like, hey, we just wanted to do that. <laughs> yeah, people at Allison's wedding probably thought we were paid to keep the dance floor going, but we were just- such good friends anyway but like i'm like i don't think i've ever heard of that happening at a wedding but sure i don't know if he was trying to be hip like he's like oh i'm talking to like young people so and this was like three days before magfest um or like two days i think we had a day or two between and then we left for magfest and that's when i convinced Odie to fall in love with me so like that was a pretty ridiculous weekend um, and weak. And I was like, is anybody gonna believe that we did this? So, we got paid. It was hot. <laughs> Will you dance at my non-existent wedding? Yeah, sure. <laughs> so. I'm not seeing any sharks. That's what I'm doing right now. I'm trying to find these dang sharks. And where are they? Oh, you guys hit tune like forever ago. And I think there are like three people still here that had a tune. Well, marching band, you're gonna be choosing our town tune. So tell me what song you want and I will make it our town tune while I look for sharks. So. All right, Vada, pay me to crash your wedding. I nice try, ceiling. <laughs> Oh, yeah, so I don't recommend you work for any creepy weirdos that are like, hey, I hired these dancers to crash this wedding, but, um, yeah, so don't do that, but I was like, I will never work for this guy again. Like, if this guy contacts us again and is like, oh my god, I have another, I'm gonna be like, mm, no, how about we don't do that? So, because he tried to get us to do stuff after, and I was like, yeah, I'm going to be busy that weekend, no matter what weekend you say. So. Um. Solid. Anyway. 
Yeah, stoked! Uh, you met Imperial March? Okay, sweet. That's done. Wait, am I insane? Hold on. Dun 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 dun. That's like Darth theme, theme right? Uh, oh, this is another eel. Give it to me. Yeah, okay, good. Oh no! I didn't pay any attention! Okay, well, rip. Rip eel. Um, okay, I will go change it to the Imperial March. Thank you, marching band. And hot. Diggity dog. As soon as we possibly find a shark, which probably isn't happening for some reason. Well, fine. I didn't want your shark. Yeah, miss! Um, okay. No, I scared away another fish! Let's see if I can get this mouth guy. So, oh my god, this emote! That's my newest emote. It got approved like two days ago. And I was really excited because I thought it was going to take like a hundred years and it took like three days. I'm like, ha, ah, okay. Because Odie uh, tried to get an emote approved and it took like three and a half weeks. So I was like, well, mine took like way less than that. But I don't know. Freaking black bass. All right, let's go. Oh, let's talk to Cookie first. I know, there's always something else to do. We're gonna talk to Cookie first. Uh, yeah. Cookie, you're so cute with your little cup of coffee or tea or whatever that is. Oh, you had a pretty good time, huh? It's so great that Pixie could come hang out. Big Pix. I hope they get a chance to pop in again really soon. Yay. Aw, uh, Cookie really liked you, Pixie. Um, yeah, Happy Home Academy's happening tomorrow. Sorry about your luck. Um, Prussian carp. Oh, sweet. Alright, take my carp. I don't want it. <laughs> I had a lightning bug in my pocket the other day, and whoever I talked to was like, I really want a pet lightning bug. It was either Cookie or Pooh. I think it was Cookie. I think that's it in the corner. She's wanting all my stuff. So. Aww. Aw, someone made Courage the Cowardly Dog into a remake with Cookie as Courage. That's so sweet. Courage is such a sweet dog. Um, thanks, girl. I love when they tell you something about your outfit. Like, they're like, oh, your outfit's so cute, but these shoes would go with it perfectly. Um, actually, you're not moving, so don't even talk like that. Cookie being like, mm, I'm gonna talk about the possibility of leaving. No, not okay. Oh, oh, a stag beetle. What? That's a lightning bug in the corner. You have a pet, Cookie has a pet named Cookie and she's a stag beetle. When I caught her, she pinched my hand and it hurt so bad. Cookie's kind of a jerk. But she has a sweet name, so maybe it'll make her sweet. Well, Cookie, I see no sign of the stag beetle. I just see your lightning bug. So, no. Look at you getting your little fudgy bar out. Is butter a carb? Yep. Is butter a carb? <laughs> Thank you for yep. the bits. Thank you for the- is butter yep. a carb? Yes, is bit. Um, oh, thanks, Mr. Wario. Thank you. Um, wait, what? Okay, you're going to a costume party with a friend. What costume do you wear, mean girl? Oh, some full body tights. Yes, girl. Give me that full body tight. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Full body tight. Nothing else. Just the tights. Okay, wooden low table. 
No. Oh yeah, she. I was like, why do I have this gaping hole? Um, I learned a new recipe with the um, tire I caught. I think it's probably the tire stack or whatever. Well, look at her eating her ice cream. I think it takes three. Hold on. Uh, yeah. So, cool. Um, alright, Cookie. Well, we'll leave you to your ice cream. And good night, Mr. Wario. But yeah. You pick vampire and Pinky said it would said wouldn't it make the food bad because vampires hate garlic? Oh, she got sad because she didn't get the joke. How could you do that to her? Alright, we're gonna go change this town tune finally. I just wanted to bug somebody and since Tutu is listening to KK, we can't bug her. One of the two cuties, because Cookie and Tutu are my two favorite neighbors. Fave names. Um, I also need to do this before I forget. Oh, apparently I did forget yesterday, because I definitely had like the 300 bonus the other day. Um, okay, so I need... I think I have both of those fences. Yeah. I think we're good. Oh wait, no! I wanted to see the shopping! Okay, hold on, hold, 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 hold the phone. Nook shopping. Um... And it's a bunch of crap we already have. KK Rally. KK Rally has a really cute cover. Uh, okay, I don't want any of that. Um... Why did it look like Nook was twerking? It's Nook. Oh, he is kind of twerking working on that shelf. We should see if we have a five star rating too. I haven't checked our rating in a while. Um, so let's talk e-balls. Oh, what? Four star. Back in my day, the key uh, um, Wait, what? Mm. Oh. They don't like that I cut down a bunch of freaking trees because I'm moving stuff around. Come on, that's so dumb. I'm trying to like make an island look good. Okay, so let's do the island tune. And I'm gonna turn this up. So if you hear a little echo, that's what it is. So. I might have to make it higher. I might have to make it higher to begin with. Maybe. Yeah, I think I could do that. No, that doesn't sound right though. Dang it. I'm gonna use this bottom for... How many lower was that? Oh no, that's right, okay. I gotta hear this, cause I am not. No, what's wrong? Dun dun dun. Dun 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 dun. I don't like it this high though. I feel like it does need to be lower. Okay, 
I need to take off the N because it's confusing. Anyway, <clears throat> you can find it on Google. Somebody already made it. Yeah, but I like to make them myself. I'll use Google if I need to, though. Why does it not? Why is there a note? Why is it not sounding right? Like, there's just like not. Yeah, Google isn't helpful. Just ask the guy who got kicked out. I'll see what they did because like, the thing is, it's like this minor key BS that doesn't work with me half the time. So, okay, Imperial March. No, March Animal Crossing. Uh. Oh, somebody used E for it. Uh, fine, I'll use E. I'll see how this sounds. I just don't like how- I didn't want it that high, but I think I don't have any choice anyway. Yeah, it, it almost has to be higher, because I don't think that note's right either if you don't do it like this. Yeah, like, that's like not- that's like not right. Um, I don't like that. I don't like it! Uh... I'm gonna go back to C, cause that's wrong. That's out of tune, Google, good job. Um. Oh, I've been lurking, Corazon. I lurk all the time. I am like the queen of lurking, so love you too, no problem. Okay, C, I'm gonna see if it, E, C, ah, E, wait, no, this E. See. Yeah, like, see how it has to be off because it's like not a minor key. Okay, no, I don't like it. Like, it has like that. All right, well, it's close enough, so we'll leave it like that because that's kind of what I was trying to do. Could I do a G instead of that A? Would that sound better? I mean, it's still wrong, but... Yeah, it's gonna be wrong no matter what because it's like a minor key. All right, it's a little janky, but that's okay. Darth is a little janky, so we'll go with it. <laughs> uh, this is like the only chat I talk in, yeah. Bree. That's, I mean, I don't talk in my... Oh, it sounds right when she does it, at least. So, thank you, marching band. We now have the Imperial March as our town tune. Um, yeah, I... I'm like very in and out in chat if I am chatting, but. Oh, I can turn this down now. Sorry. There's probably a lot of echo. See, Isabel sang it right, but. Anyway, proud cheater, how's it going? There's a duck on my beach who won't wake up. Probably Gulliver, and he's not exactly a duck. But I, I get you. I get you meaning. Um, okay, I need to find sharks. Die. Oh, you know what we should do? We should look at our sharks that we have so far, because they're super cute in the museum. Um, but yeah. So let's go. Because the museum is absolutely gorgeous, and I love it. So, and we haven't really looked at it because I had nothing in it, and it was, like, shameful. 
So I was like, oh, we probably need to take care of this. Oh, that's the first fish I've seen in this tank. Yay! In either of my games. My other game doesn't have anything in that tank either. Um, okay. So let's go. I love this. I have a whale shark in my other town too. And they look so cool swimming together. Like the whale shark and big great white. I love the anchovies in there. The anchovies are the ones like swirling. You need the whale shark? Gotta get it. Um, you like my island because it's not full of clutter? Oh, well, thanks. I mean, I'm still working on it, so it has some open areas that are, like, totally boring and bland, but, you know. Um, oh, okay, the weird one, the, the era Pima, or however you say that. That was, like, one of the second ones I caught, like, on the new month. I'm like, what? I, like, never fish in the rivers. How did I catch this big old boy? But I did. There's the eel hiding back there. So it's still a little bear. Like, it's my museum in my other town is, like, way more established. But we're getting there. We've definitely built up from what it was before. Because, holy crap, it was not anything. Um, it's so big that whenever I see it, I freak myself out. No, I hate that. I hate when you, like, your nerves get to you. Like, oh my god, I have to catch it. And then you mess up. <laughs> it happens that's how I am with scorpions as we saw earlier which it doesn't even matter like I have one in my museum so I'm just catching it for like bells now but I am like the worst I because they don't do the little jump thing like the tarantulas so they're way harder to catch I'm like I can't do this so I don't know I, I end up messing up and not doing what I should be doing. So during the day, I, the butterflies are like flying all over. And we have like a lot of butterflies because we've been focusing on that. So this actually looks like way cool during the day. As opposed to, I mean it looks cool now too, but they're all just like sitting. So, um, but yeah. So... You find scorpions easier, like, to catch or just to find? I think they're harder to catch. When it comes to them showing up, it's about the same as tarantulas for me. Big scorp. Big scorp. I just realized that all those little miniature uh, pieces are, like, miniature wave breakers or whatever. That's really cute. I don't think I've actually caught a hermit crab for the museum yet. Well, poopy stink butts. I better go take care of that. Um, scorpion was the very first thing I caught, like, that I donated. Like, once we had an actual museum, which is kind of weird, but it was- I should not have caught it. I did the worst job ever, and I just swung my net, like, four times, but I was next to a tree, so he kept, like, running around me and the tree, and I eventually got him. It was pretty much a big fat cheat, though. I didn't mean to do it either. It just magically happened. So, pretty hype. Pretty hype. But I haven't done, like, the scorpion hunting on islands yet. Oh, it's raining now. Well, shoot. Uh, I haven't done scorpion hunting at all yet because it's just, like, harder for me to catch them. I don't know. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea, but... Oh, look at them in all their little rain outfits now. Tutu always with her pink wardrobe. So cute. I love it. Okay, what was I going to do? There was something I was going to do. And I don't... Oh, I was going to go look for sharks and a hermit crab. I don't know if hermit crabs come out in the rain. I'm not 100% sure on that, so we'll just kind of keep our eyes peeled and... Oh, they do! Oh crap. These are like not hard to catch. Why am I having a hard time with this? There we go. <sighs> What's my least favorite villager? Mm. I think somebody's asked me this before and I don't really have a good answer because 
I see potential in all the villagers, but like, I just don't like- <laughs> This sounds so stupid. There's some that I just think are uglier than others, and I'm like- I just don't like their look. It's not really about like disliking them, it's just like, uh, I don't like their look. Like, I don't like Claude. Um, I wouldn't want Hippo because he's gross. Um, yeah, any of the ones that are like super open mouth beardy are like not my friend right away. So. I'm not big on Hippo, I'm not big on- I'm not really big on any of the bunnies. I'm- I don't think the bunny design is very cute. And I'm def- I know I'm in the minority because I think Zipper's a cutie and the rest of the bunnies are like not as cute as Zipper. And so many people think Zipper's creepy and they love like bunny and I'm like, mm. So, I'm not the biggest fan of the bunnies. Tiffany is my favorite bunny which is weird because she's like- a snooty and a lot of people don't like her and I'm like I she was one of my OG like wild world villagers so I have a soft spot for her and like Monique I just love to hate on so like she's a cute cat like she's like a Marilyn Monroe little cat like you can't what the heck that's that shadow is not even that big what <laughs> casual Casual blast from the past. Yeah, this is the first fish I've caught in the rain. Like, what? <laughs> I was not even trying, but okay. Hot. Um. Sorry that it's now the truth for the entire world that we all have to like Hippo. But yeah, we all have to like Hippo now. That's only because you ended up with him and got stuck with him, Snack. Um. But yeah. Ursula? Isn't she a- is she a cub? I feel like she's weird looking, whoever she is. I don't know. Don't know! I gave him heinous clothing and it's gray! Oh, Ursula's a big bear. I feel like she's not one of my favorites. I love the bears, but there are a couple that I'm like, mm. like Paula I'm not really into. And for some reason we always find Paula and I'm like, no. So. <laughs> he nicknamed you Maestro. Okay. My nickname? I don't remember who first said it. I think it was um, Biscuit came up with the nickname of Prof Pie. So I'm Professor Pie. And then somebody was like, I, oh my god, my nickname for you is unoriginal. What should I call you now? And I changed it to Dr. Popular based on Cody calling us Dr. Popular MD in the original Animal Crossing. So. Are there even snooty bears in this game? Uh, I don't even think, off the top of my head, I can't think of any. It's really weird. Yeah, are there any snooty bears? Oh, Ursula used to be snooty. Okay. But is she snooty in this game? Judy's a cub, though. Like, I'm talking the big bears. Like, I can't think of any that are snooty. Does anyone have Pico? I don't even know if I'm saying that right, but does anybody have her? I have not seen her yet. So... Taryn has Pico? I was like, is she even in this game? I haven't seen her at all. Sweet. CJ, Maverick, how's it going? Yeah, Judy's a cub, so... She's not one of the big bears. She's one of the little bears. No, fish. Come on, I'm gonna go to the other side. All right, get my bait, take it. Take my bait. Yeah. Judy and Megan are both new and they're both cuties because they're so colorful. They are big, colorful cuties. I think a dace is one of the ones that I caught but didn't donate, so. Um, we'll have to get on that.
Nah, no snooty bears. They're too gentle. I knew it. I knew they were. I knew there was a reason. There's no snooty bears. So many people hate on Beardo, and like I love Beardo too. Beardo the weirdo. I actually don't have any tea tonight. No, I started the stream off, and I had like just finished some tea that I made this afternoon. So I, and I didn't ever. I had like that much left, so I just poured the rest out because it was cold and. So, I have not had it for this stream. I actually had it before, so. But, yeah. I thought you meant truth tea. No, I didn't. I, you know me. I'm always spilling the tea. But I have not been drinking tea for, like, majority of the stream. Okay, I gotta do donate some of these things. Put that in storage. Put this in storage. Put this in storage. Um, for those of you who weren't here earlier too, I'll show off my new room one more time, because I should. It's been a while since we looked at it. But yeah, look at how cute my kitchen is! I have the mint chocolate chip kitchen going on, so this is the idea behind this. Um, and I really love the way it's turning out, so I ended up getting all this mint colored kitchen stuff, and I had this floor, and I really wanted to use it. Um, and it just kind of worked and then Cookie sent me this tea kettle when I got the new room expansion and I'm like, what? That's so cute! So, like I said, I want my house to be very old-fashioned and like the whole thing to be kind of like a cottage. Even though we're doing like a Mean Girls room upstairs, I still want it to be like thematic to the rest of the house. And luckily Regina's room in the movie is very like classy, so we're just gonna keep it with that. Um... But yeah, so, and I, I love this living room. I love the redesign of this. It's my fave. My fave bay. So. Anyway. Um, I am gonna go donate this stuff. And I'm gonna try one, to find like one more shark and then I'm probably gonna call it a night. So. Has anyone gotten a uh, the 51 clubhouse games i want to get it once it goes on sale like it, it'll probably be a while but and obviously i'm pretty preoccupied preoccupied with this game anyway um but i got it for Odie for our an engagement anniversary that we celebrated a couple days ago oh, what am i doing and like the games in it are so cute and it has so many games from my childhood that I have like not played since college because I actually took a history of games and toys class in college. And uh, one of the, or several of the games I played were like classics from my childhood, but. Um, yeah, I'm like, oh my God, this brings up so many memories. Like, I made Odie play Mencala because I grew up with that game. And then, I can't remember what the name of it is in the game, but I grew up with Aggravation. I played that every single time I went to my grandpa's house, which was, like, every weekend. I stayed all night there because I loved spending time with my grandpa. And Slim was actually streaming it yesterday. And I don't remember what, like, the basic B name of aggravation is that's like a licensed version of it there's like a million different versions of it but um i was like oh my god i have not played this game in years and um my grandpa who i was really close to and i grew up really close to he passed away uh, about a year and a half ago and he was the last of my grandparents so it's like oh it just made me feel so special like it made me very nostalgic for that game so but yeah but I'm really liking what I've seen of it I watched Odie play it that night that I got it for him when it came out and then I watched Slim stream it it looks really fun though Kyla Funhouse with even a hydrate mm. come on girl drink some aqua thank you Caleb I appreciate, oh, I appreciate the hydrate. Come on, get my rubber ducky. Yeah. Give it to me. Woo hoo, big whale shark 
ladies. There she blows. Woohoo! <laughs> all right. Catching all three of the big boys. Let's go. Donate. Um. Oh, you caught it while you were at my place too. Yay. Whale shark. Hi. The water helped you. <laughs> Yeah, we'll, we'll blame it on the, the hydrate, the water. Um, yay! Ending with a newbie? That's awesome. I love it. Um, yeah, girl! Let's go! So. Cool, 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 cool beans! Girl. Okay. Um, let's go ahead and donate this, and then I'm gonna go show this off, too, because it's super cool. Like, it looks so good. Um, oh no. Give me that whale. Give me that big old whale. Yes, give me the facts. Okay, so, mighty whale shark is the largest species of fish in the world with specimen up to 60 feet long. Unlike many other kin in the shark family, whale sharks are non-violent, eating only plankton and such. Oh. They grow slowly and live long, relaxed lives of filter feeding and leisure and warm water. So if you're ever if you ever have to choose a fish as a roommate, you could do worse than the whale shark. Unless you can't swim, then you're boned. And there you have it. Hot. Uh, giving it a ba for JG is the boss 12. Oh my gosh. Well, that was hype. Hype for the whale shark. So now it'll be swimming alongside... <laughs> Unless you're a plankton, yeah. Then you might not have the most peace peaceful roomy situation. But yeah, now it'll be swimming alongside the Great White. So we'll go ahead and check this out. I actually got these sharks in my other town months and months ago. It was like right when this game came out because I had some friends that had their town set to Southern Hemisphere. And so I was able to get sharks that way. But there's our big old whale friend. Woohoo! Sucker fish and horse mackerel. Great White Shark. And then the anchovies, I believe, are on this board right here. Yeah. So, yay! Like I said, I kind of just started working on the museum. Oh, there's our big boy, um, our big rainfish, our big colocanth or whatever. Um, what the heck? Is there like an individual tank? Individual tanks here? What? Um, but yeah. What if you could catch whales in this game? can't. I would not be okay with that. I would be so upset by that. I'd be like, mm, mm inhumane, not happening. Because a whale's just not a fish, you know? So. Whales are my favorite animal, so any kind of captivity of them, I am so far against. It's ridiculous. I will petition out the wazoo to get um, whales out of What's it called? What the heck is it called? What is the word I'm looking for? Out of, uh, to not, to get them released and not captured. So, anyway. Um, okay, well, I think that we're gonna call it with that. So thank you guys so much for joining me. I'm gonna run the credits here while we're on this rainy beach. Honestly, great white sharks just can't be kept in captivity. True. That is actually very true. Um, what? Madam, please, the points, the dab. Oh, Kaboomik, I was supposed to dab for you like forever ago and I failed. Captivity, thank you, Domo X Domo, I failed. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for being here tonight. It's been a really fun and relaxing night. Um, I'm going to pull up my credits. So give me a hot second here while I do well, I do so. Mm. Yes, okay. So let's check out these credits, yo! We're ready. Also, I need to um, move this. Oh, I guess it doesn't really matter. It's like covered up anyway. Okay, so every heart, here we go. You know the drill. Um, so thank you guys so much. 
for all your support um, to this stream. Thank you for the donation, Psycho, Waluigi, and Mr. Wario. Thank you for the bits, Armand, Psycho, Mr. Wario, and Scottman. To my mods who are here. Kitty, you're back! Thank you so much to my mods who are here and who have been here throughout the night. Uh, thank you to the new followers. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much to Corazon Peach for the raid. I know it doesn't come up here with raids. I wish it did, but... And thank you for all the subs and the gift subs as well. Kaboomic with all those gift subs in the house tonight. So thank you guys so, 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 so much. Um, I'm gonna find someone to raid, hopefully. Shout out to Inuyasha. And shout out to Inuyasha getting a sequel in like 2020 or whatever. Um, yeah. Let's go. I guess we could raid big ol' Slimbo. Because we were talking about him. He's playing Dragon Quest XI. So, yeah, number one mod, Bree. Hot. Um, Alright, well, let's see. What's our hashtag? Probably should be something about the, sh the sharks. Because, like, why the heck not? You know what I mean? I'm so stoked! Oh, freaking stoked. I can't. I cannot. Um, so, before we raid and while we come up with a hashtag, you guys, just a reminder, uh, my schedule, I stream Mondays and Tuesdays at 1 p.m. Eastern and Fridays and Saturdays at 8 p.m. Eastern. I alternate between Mario Party and Animal Crossing New Horizons, and my current um, my current stream schedule is Mario Party. We're doing the GameCube Mario Parties on Fridays. Uh, next up's Mario Party Six for this Friday, and then Animal Crossing New Horizons Saturday and Tuesday, and then Monday Mario Party is always random. So this Monday, however, I have a funeral to go to. Um, so if I stream, it'll be later in the day. It won't be at the regular time. So, yeah, whale shark roommate. Okay, let's do it. Whale shark roommate. Wait, how do you, does roommate have two M's? It does. It's one of those, wait, does it? Hold on. Why does that look so wrong? You know when you like never type a word, but then when you look at it, it just doesn't look right at all. <laughs> it's so weird. All right, well, thank you guys so much for joining me. I will see you, if not on Monday, then I will see you on Tuesday at 1 p.m. for more of Animal Crossing New Horizons. And we'll just get back to, we'll probably do gardening that day because that's more fun to do during the day and we can't shark hunt. So let's get going with that Slim Cribby stream. All right, I love you guys. Thank you so much for all the hype on my path to partner. Bye.